Melody's back in the building. And yes, I know, just in case you did not know before, I actually read your comments. So I always know when you guys are dragging me and saying things on YouTube and looking for Tolani and saying, Melody, where is Tolani? You guys were, you guys can ganged up against Quincy. I'm going to go into all of that. But yes, for Tolani, Tolani is not around. He traveled and he has refused to come back. I don't know if he's trying to use this one to clear his passport so that he can jack her. Uh, no, Do you yeah. understand? My guy Stylishly don't trying to jack her, but I am not, the, <laughs> it's not on me. Please ask Tolani when he's going back to his motherland in Nigeria. You won't leave me here with T-Pain alone. But yes, I've got Smith in the building. And I've got Uche in the building. And for today on Zero Conditions Podcast, we're talking about all the amazing popping gist that happened over the week. And I'm getting insight from both of them. I don't know if Uche has any insight to give me <laughs> or Smith has any insight to give me, but we're about worry, to find I got out. You, I got you. <laughs> we're about to find out. How are you guys doing? Yeah, I mean, I'm chilled, man. It's been a really, really long week. So, I mean, you guys be honest, though. Don't yeah. come and be giving I mean, us. We are here for you, Melody. I don't want to hear censored answers. It's been, it's, about it's, you. it's been a really long week, and we're just here to chill. Hey, hey, hey. Have fun. Yeah. We're good. We're, we're calm. Smith, what about you? How was your week? Honestly, week was, um, it's interesting. It's been an interesting week. Both What's interesting is in Nigeria. No, the whole package mentally, physically, financially, spiritually. It's <laughs> Everything. Been, it's been a ball game. But do you think that um, for people that work in the industry, sorry, for you guys, for <laughs> who are, who who are, are you guys? You guys. <laughs> you guys <laughs> who are you guys? Do you think who that the industry guys? provides like mental support system for you guys? I'm not the only mental support system. Absolutely you not. Your church, you. Absolutely not. I mean, your church. you need to devise your own means. Man. Yes. Thank you have you to find much. a way for your own. I mean, industry, we have a lot of events, activations, and all of that, but I don't think those... I mean, for some of us, it's, it's work. I mean, leave my for some of them, that's it. It's, it's work, you know? Industry events, but I think as an industry person, you have to have your own solitude, you know? Yeah, your Self-time. own time of zen. Hmm. Outside and inside, or maybe inside of work. Yep. Yeah, you know? true. So... Yeah, Smith, how, what's your own? Zen. Why, why did you start? start it, you no, know? but wait. Wh- how do you create? Honestly, like, how do you create? Do you get overwhelmed easily as a person? Be honest. Um, On a scale of one to ten, how easily I mean, do you get overwhelmed mentally? I mean, that's a good question because I feel like, personally, mm-hmm. for you to be overwhelmed is you giving that room. Hmm. You know, everything is usually just in your head at the end of the day, hmm. right? So. Again, I think because of my background in engineering, yeah. so I kind of understand systems and how to... Just your skill of priority, basically. Like there, there can be a million things, but you know the one that is more important to try and build towards, you know. I mean, I think that that's, that's the best way. I, as a person, handles pressure and, and all of that. Smith, what about you? Do you get overwhelmed easily? No. No. I get irritated. Irritated, okay. By I get... <laughs> this guy is an idiot. Fast. Irritated. I get very irritated. Fast, like fast. fast. It checks out like once, fast. Once you don't pop, 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 I don't the, I don't the find person where I will slap. Well, as someone who can relate to that, I, I feel like for me as a person, my pressure point is always very easy to get to. And because of how I am, like whenever I am really really in that space like whenever i'm there, there's so much on my table as a person i naturally do not necessarily know how to handle that i already have a problem with not being able to communicate when i'm in a headspace or just isolating so now dealing with all of that now makes it super worse and i feel like because of the space that you all are in yeah i don't think that there is it's even beyond like for you guys because i know that you guys work in like in the music space and you guys manage artists do you guys go out of your way to provide emotional or mental support for your artists or you guys just ask them to show up in the studio and just be recording that's standard now i mean me i want to start from your own idea you know i think personally i can understand someone like you yeah yeah when it comes to this space i think that mm. you actually work in the music industry as well in your yes, own, no, I don't your own. so, so you are making it look like well at the end of the day, I get to you, and I and I think that at the core of it is just to know how to relate to people. Hmm. I I for one, I don't know, maybe because of my, you know, um, the way I grew up, right? I grew up in a family of five, all guys. All okay, guys, you don't I, have a I'm sister. I'm the last. Yes, no, not one sister. Huh. So I'm the last guy, and I think that the way men 
sort of like interact and communicate. I'm 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 getting this over. Relax. Mm -hmm. I'm getting this over. The way men interact and communicate amongst them, them themselves, mm -hmm. you kind of want to know because for someone like you, Melody, I think is about knowing when to act and knowing when to live with you. Like when the, the person has to give you the support, they should give you. And when it's not necessary, you just I agree. Just leave. You I agree. understand. So and for me, I. I understand patterns, I understand people, and I feel yeah. like I can just, you know, synergize around people. So, yeah. I'm not asked to deal with people, but yeah. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. If, <laughs> if you if you had the option to not... <laughs> if I had the option to live in the middle of the city... And just give me like $1 million. I would do it. <laughs> <laughs> like, just, you know, have a house in the middle of the city and just wake up in the morning. But people will miss I'll you, though. <laughs> Some people yeah. will miss you. <laughs> it? So it's what about you? Will you miss me? Yes, but yeah. some yeah, other people you. will miss you. A lot of us will miss you, actually. Of course. Well, some other I know, I know miss someone in particular that will roll on the floor every day. He'll not see you like this. Oh, wow. Are you serious? But <laughs> I know people will miss you. Yeah. I mean, you, you have, people, you have family, are, are, are they focus on the one person? Like this, oh, wow. But she person. has family. She has brothers. Yes, no. she has mother. That's it. In the grand scheme of things, everybody, those are your people. Me, I think thing single at one person. I'm not going to answer you, but okay. it's fine. It's yes. cool. I agree with you. Know. Anyways. <laughs> so, speaking about artists and emotional support, I think that um, for you guys, to be honest, I know that you work with artists, you work with talent, you work with DJ Voice, you work with your artists. Don't use this opportunity to sell your artist market. First of all, don't let's even try. Wait, wait now, calm down. Don't try. I work with everybody. Yes, yeah, I'm the industry cleaning boy. No, my point is that don't use this one to say the artists you are working with. I, I say, should not call his name. No, don't say. But there are multiple people. Though. That's, yeah, that's fine, they're actually multiple. That's the thing. There are multiple people. Fine. Not one person. I don't want to know you about mean, your release. You can just call one person. But I don't, I don't, I, I don't know. I don't want to hear about your release. But you're my artist now. <laughs> of course, actually, melody is actually our talent. Yes. <laughs> so you know. Anyways, but but do you guys get? I know that you guys on be unveiling artists. Do you guys ever? But that does DJ voice. Does he have like a therapist? Um, I'll say no. So how are but, you providing yeah, that? Yeah, support? I mean, with DJ Voice, it's been two to three years of being a gym rat. Also, right now, so that he found out. But prior to, to 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 that, you could tell. I mean, we'll be in traffic. You know, somebody's not moving well. He's just be ginger. He will just be angry. <laughs> and somebody can bear with weakness. His road manager tips. You know, just be Like, and myself, I even have some some recording on my phone. Yeah. Like different times that. In traffic, it's like no. It's, he might be the one driving. But you see, if he's not driving, it's even worse. He will come down, go and reroute that <laughs> post conjecture wow. scenario. So, going on and there. I could tell that ah, this boy. But he didn't come down to punch anybody. No, he I've, won't I've punch anybody. But I mean, the art boss is enough. So I think that artists should just kind of because they are human beings as yeah, well. Yes, they are. So they just have to kind of focus on like things that can just give them that mental invest in therapy. Yeah. Mm. Give them that mental, you know. Mm. Start sign up for the gym. Mm -hmm. Some of us have walk, been walk every day. You can play involved. tennis. You can. I mean, you can involve. Just find something. Something. Yeah, exactly. Something to just have been take your mind off work and stuff. Unconventionally enrolled as the therapist for the artist. For the artist. Have you finished doing therapies for yourself? I didn't find that person. Sometimes melody. we switch. Wow, melody. Sometimes, love. We switch. But it's true. Love Sometimes we switch. true. Sometimes we switch. You know. <laughs> The, person, the artist is not your own therapist. The artist wants to be the therapist. He cannot. <laughs> you know? He's like, ah, guy, what's in the worry? How far? You've not called me like some days. I say, brother, just get, leave me alone. Leave me alone. I'm going through it. Going so, through it. Um, there was something that trained during the week mm -hmm. about um, Speed Darlington. And we just had that conversation like a few days ago. Are you, are you serious? And, you know, um, so yeah, the, the story. The whole situation. Yeah, anything. the entire situation of people are alleging that um, Spindalinti was his mom coming out at first to say that her son is... Disclaimer, basically. if we're having a conversation or whatever you have about me or anybody that is close to me, mm -hmm. family should not be... That's like, there's, a, there's a level of like... I feel like there should be a line that should be drawn in the sand. What do you mean? Just don't involve... Family. Family. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I, I think I know, what, I know what you're referring to, but yeah. let, me, let me just yeah, give the backstory let her, let her, for people that don't have it. Yeah. So, Spidality's mom came out and said her son was missing. She couldn't find her son. To be honest, when people were saying that Spidality was missing, I thought it was, I thought it was publicity stuff. Yeah, I just had, thought, yeah, I'm like, oh, another, another, another stuff again from this industry and, and stuff. And, you know, but over time, the commission kept growing and yeah. growing and becoming like a serious thing. And, you know, people started alleging that 
um, it had something to do with Brenner, and Brenner was on her. Yeah, he was kidnapped. He was blah, 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 blah. And then Brenner came out and said, who is missing? Then deleted the tweet. Yeah. You know, the conversation was going on. And after a while, and after I seen videos of Speed Darlington where he was saying the meanest, uncalled for things, you know, connecting oh, Brenner to all manner yeah. of things. And, you know, trying to diminish his hard work with the Grammys, connected to Didi, just saying different things. Not one, not, not two, one, not, not two, not yeah. three videos. I'm like, wait, this actually did happen. I didn't see it previously. I don't follow Darlington. And, of course, then eventually they, then he got released allegedly. But the conversation now spiraled into people saying that, of course, I saw a video from VDM where he was saying that, oh, opp um, oppression, that, you know, Bonner Boy should not be like the people that use power because you're in a higher position and someone is calling you out, you know, using your power to arrest people. People were having that conversation. People were having a separate conversation about where do you draw the line, line as a troll yeah. or as a social media person calling out artists. Like, artists are also human beings. Do you understand? And the conversation was just layered in different ways. So where do you, where, where do you, what's your opinion of the entire situation? Now, the, the question I'm actually asking is about artists getting trolled because to be honest they get trolled a lot mm -hmm. and a lot of times unnecessarily mm -hmm. and Brenner is someone that gets trolled a whole lot mm -hmm. do you understand and on the other on the flip side of people saying freedom of speech people can say whatever they want to say what's the is there sh what's the balance um, yeah. how did you like see the entire situation um, I mean personally first of all right you should I don't know let me speak from an art artist's perspective yeah I think just like every other career that you choose like you want to be famous you want to do stuff you you are a creative in your own right mm -hmm. the moment you attain that fame just know that i mean <laughs> you cannot control people's yeah, you opinion can't. about you, you have to develop it's always going to come skin. i mean people are reacting from different environment like people are going through things so they they can just use you as their as their Outlet. yes mm -hmm. and just keep spiraling and keep going. so release. But at the end of the day, I, I feel like um, for, that, for this particular situation with Spidalinton, it's like, first of all, I think attention is like a drug. Hmm. And in 2024, when, you, when people can just, in a world where people can just put on their cameras and set say their anything. room and say anything they like, my own is that you can't be saying some things and some people know your house address. address. You know, so, you so, so is, it, is it the house address that is your problem, or what my own? Is, so, I mean, it, it, it ties because it's like actions and consequences. Yeah, you understand. So it's like you you know that what you're about to do is is really really messed up. Mm -hmm. So, and you know that consequence. There might if you have to go to the to to that length, why why can't people find you like? Yeah. If they can find you, why, like why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? You should be somewhere in. You should be anonymous. Somewhere in like Asia or, or something, you know? like nobody knows. In before you can the come the on, so that they can online, and I, I think so. And also, I mean, shout out to everybody for giving platforms to people that yeah. just see. Thank God for Bass and Drum. Do you understand? <laughs> uh -huh. Giving platform for people that see. Anything. I mean, is you is all of us fault for actually. You know, soaking in all of this. It, yeah, um, it's been a, a trend. People just say things, attract attention, whether or not it's good. Negative people. or positive. Like, I don't know. So I think that from the artist's perspective, you cannot control o opinions. Mm -hmm. So you just have to do, a, like, I mean, find your way to navigate. You know, that's why you, you should have your core team. And after your core team, obviously, you should also be able to spot honest opinions and agendas. You know, that's why that's okay. what I said. What about you, Space? Well, I would say from a viewer's standpoint, I think a lot of people are forgetting that artists are human beings. We're all human beings. Yep. So empathy should be like if not a thing. Should like we should put that as something that's just have remorse. Because it's almost like, like what she said, one guy from Agbulegba mm -hmm. that is probably tweeting us, mm -hmm. you know, from, you know, his workshop, mm -hmm. is going through all that he's going through in life. Yeah. And he has seen something that he cannot get. Yeah. Will never probably get. 
mm-hmm. and then somebody is misusing it, yeah. or whatever the case may be, he'll be angry. And he's, angry. he's already angry. Yes. So how can he channel this thought now? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Alpha, comment session. <laughs> comment. Uh, I this agree, person, actually. This person. I agree, but actually. But then you, you, we always forget that different patterns, different footsteps, we need to also include ourselves in other people's thoughts. Mm-hmm. Like for this person to misuse or do whatever X, Y, Z, mm-hmm. what was their premeditated thoughts for that? Mm-hmm. Do you get it? Like, did you think, ah, people say this person, they go through one thing, you yeah, know they're all right. Now why you talk this thing? And then you on the receiving end, the artist, it's like, you already know what you signed up for. So you're saying that artists should expect anything? No, ex- expect the worst from everybody. You're coming. I I I be telling some artists that I um, I I turn off my comment sections. I'm like, okay. imagine that option was not available. So how do they protect themselves? I mean, that's, 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 I mean, I think that's, understanding I think that's, where I think you that's stand. A, yes. Very very unfair. Un- understanding where you stand and the mm. business that you are in should give you some perspective. No, I don't like, agree. No, see. What do you mean by growth thick skin? Okay, okay, okay. Growth thick skin. The same the same exposure that you have that. Is helping you sell records, the same exposure that is helping you sell out your, your shows, the same exposure, the same community that is helping you, you know, make revenue. You also would get backlash from this same community. Exactly, is no. is what it is. You if expect it if to you be don't want to do it, then don't be an ar- artist. Go inside your house. Go and do I don't take a, like, take what a you degree or, or something. See this camera where you wear now. <laughs> you wear red. Okay. Actually, they come up for your house now. Okay, Show you so no plan. See, what if soldier jam me? So I'm just finding out that you can't. Wait. But this is not the green. I thought it's no, only I just green. Talk. No, wait now. Wait. I think See. it's the pattern. No. Is it the pattern? It, yes. The oh pattern. God, I beg. I didn't know. I, I thought it was you, only the green one. I, you can't wait wear. now. Make I ask you a question now. Come mm-hmm. on. I should come. Wait till make you wear this camo. Wait, you know. Nothing. I just wanted to wear it. You just want to wear camo. No, I, I wanted to wear this design. And, it's, and it's, cute. it's cute. Okay, so about this fine growing thick skin, right? <laughs> for artists now. should just come up for that. No worry, no worry. There's this video. There's this video that that. People be ah oh God, social media is wicked. Yeah, yes, people no, be no, bringing no. up every it's, time this video cool. of um, this guy white money in the studio. Oh, oh no, no. Timaya, Timaya, <laughs> guys. No, that one is normal. I I felt sorry for Timaya. Why did you feel sorry for Timaya? We didn't, you didn't have to be there. It. You didn't have. So to are you feeling there, sorry man. for Timaya, or you are feeling sorry for? The entire for scenario, the entire scenario was just mm-hmm. like, was, I mean, for white money, money, for was white money. White money was just expressing. Was expressing himself, and I felt sorry about Timaya that being. So was just like, like, for, but Timaya is the one that was victim. <laughs> okay, so wait, exactly. so, so wait, the conversation, so wait now. This, this is where I'm going with this conversation. Uh-huh. For Timaya and white money white in that money. situation, white money was in the studio recording, having mm-hmm. a good time, trying to do his thing. Yes. Okay. And for sure, as he, as he as should. He should. <laughs> And Timaya was not in the, in studio. the studio. Unfortunately for him. Unfortunately. <laughs> so do you see that what you are doing now? No, no, now, now, people now made that entire conversation about why money and now sympathizing with Timaya. Timaya. Why would she not sympathize? Because they were in the studio you would sympathize and with doing Timaya. music. Now, nobody has even talked about, oh, okay, white money doing the music. Which is fine. You, and nobody you says you what you want so to do. Why are you sympathizing? Why is sympathizing for Timaya? Again, Melody. <laughs> Was it distressed? It's tart. White money is allowed to express. Express. Okay. Sometimes Maya is not allowed to be in that ex- environment. That environment while you're expressing. Now, <laughs> sometimes your expression can be detrimental to the next person's mental health. That's all. So the conversation around that video has been about what both of you are saying. Like, oh my God, sorry for Timaya. Yes. Oh my God, I can't believe Timaya. <laughs> I think it was like... I saw somebody, it was, I saw oh somebody, God. That, I saw somebody <laughs> say that it was at this moment that Timaya Timaya knew he fucked up. No, 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 no. <laughs> But well, at this moment, that Tamaya was asking the universe <laughs> all the ways that made him end up in this situation. Yes, like, like what happened? You know, what happened? You know, there, there this that don't save my money you, prayers. You know, there are things that happen to you, you be like, how did I, how did I end up? <laughs> Guy, like, how did I put if myself? What that video? You get one time, we want this. Like, what was the flitch? But now, as guys who work with artists, yeah. right? Mm-hmm. Now. Are you guys ever in a situation where you tell an artist, you're in, you're, have you ever been in a situation where an artist is recording music and you tell them, nah, this music is bullshit? Yes, yes, 100%. 100%. Have you ever told an artist it just happened that, last week. I don't think you should be doing this. It just yes, happened last week. 100%. I mean, I, I like to look at it as if you want my honest opinion. <laughs> you can't even get it from me. I'll tell you, right? Because. You're not going to say you tell some, me, say. Like, no vex, no vex. Why can't we get it from you? Because yes, a lot of why? times. 
when you say these things, like, oh, I don't really think this is a good idea. I don't really think you should do this. First and foremost, mm-hmm. I don't think there's any formula for music where anybody will say, oh, anybody knows for sure that this well, music is fantastic. Because mm-hmm. there have been super That'd successful be artists and super successful music that people have put out. Even, you know, people like Kanye talking about people not believing in him at the beginning and thinking yes. he couldn't do it. Right. And people telling you for sure, for sure that this is not going to work. Yeah, but then- and you now go on to make it work. Also, here, I feel like generally as... as in Nigeria, I don't know about, I don't, I've never lived outside of Nigeria. Mm-hmm. Artists in this space or people in this space do not take feedback well. Yes. If you send you something Absolutely. and you tell them, I don't think this is going to work. I don't Absolutely. think it's a, Next thing, they'll go and tell people that you say they're not good enough. Not good. Then when the music now blows, I say, you tell me, say, yeah. so please. So look at me, say, I'm not good. No, I don't want to, do you understand? So, and I feel like people don't know how to take that feedback. But for you people that you know, you have to do it. Do you ever tell you, have you ever told somebody that I don't think you should be doing music because... Uh, let's see, Master. Okay. okay. So, I mean, with... With Be all honest. you've said, I want to start by saying um, there are so many factors, right? I don't want diplomatic answer. No, 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 yes. I'm, I'm, I promise you, oh, yeah, I'm, 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 I'm straight up. <laughs> you made promise of me. Yes. I no promise of me. So, I, no, no, you first of all, me. Again, me, I will, me, I will never like There are so many factors. You, you, you started by saying how everybody has that creative freedom to be able to express and say, I mean, you can't tell, like, I mean... Everybody does music differently. Yeah. Music is subjective or relative or whatever. Mm-hmm. But again, there's there's sound and there's noise. Exactly. There's ah, there's formula you, to music. There there are systems. There there's there's why there's tonic so far, and there's why there's octaves. There, there there's why there, there are pitches hmm. and everything. So it's a whole lot of like system. So I mean. From hearing something, I don't have to say, oh, this is... In fact, you can judge music with different metrics. Mm -hmm. Oh, guy, this is not commercially viable, so jazz it up. That's a different conversation. It doesn't mean that, guy, you sound nonsense. I'm saying, oh, guy, sometimes we are speaking to artists, and Smith can bear me with with, with weakness, it's like, you are not living to your potential. Like, this music is good, but it can be better. Well, it's, it's mm-hmm. That's something. That's a conversation. So, I don't think the best people will be angry when you and say something like, like that. Mm-hmm. So, I think the, 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 the system is, is, is one. Yeah. Knowing that, oh, you, you've passed all the metrics to say, okay, this song is a song. Mm-hmm. And not noise. Right? Mm-hmm. But there's another thing where, how are you communicating it to, to the talent? I agree. Like, okay, even if this thing is so whack, I might just start by telling you that I think you need to change your producer. I think this producer doesn't pay attention to you. So you're making it about the producer now? No, like (laughs) producer because I'm telling you that maybe your your voice is still still very much cool, but it doesn't know your precepts. Hmm, precepts. You understand? So at the end of the day, it's like, Different factors, like I said, and, and contribute. yes, but what if it's the artist going on? Yes, to sometimes it's artists, actually artists. So, and me, that's where I agree with you. Yes, that even if I believe that just this, just the way I believe everybody's beautiful, right? Uh, there's you no ugly, pe- yes, there's no ugly person in life. Okay, I'm on, I'm on everybody lie. is beautiful in their own way. You. you are God's I creation. For you. Same way, is I, that I believe answer, what you genuinely God believe? Created no, ugly I genuinely people. believe that everybody's beautiful. God created ugly people. I hope you know. What is the word ugly? When two ugly people make... Then if two ugly people are, are together and one one is finer than, than the other, isn't it? No, no, no. For you to make ugly... If two ugly people are together... That's, here, one, like, I'm ready, that's terrible. That's like a bad... In decision. comparison to another person, you're always fine. In the no. life for you, because yes. now... Wait, so are you saying that there is nobody that you've ever seen that like, this person is not fine at all? Uche. They are beautiful in their own right. Way. Now, see that the way you talk. Diplomatic. What's your definition of beautiful? That's what I'm saying. You have Look a face. You. God gave you a face. Mm-hmm. You are beautiful. That's, Smith, that's the hill I'm, Smith, I'm ready to. You, you are beautiful. You agree that everybody is beautiful. No, beautiful. They are ugly people. Both in and out. No, I mean like physically. There are people that are ugly. Ugly in what sense? What do you mean? Their nose is you are, proportionally are, repulsive. Because like, okay. your face is like a detriment to your career. <laughs> <laughs> it's not <laughs> so but back to what we're saying yeah. and I'm saying that at the end of the day I feel like you have the freedom to express even if personally I think that you are untalented you won't say it no I would I would make sure I don't work with you but you would just not tell <laughs> the I yeah I would make sure I don't work with you. with you and I would tell you my honest opinion about the music itself 
So now I'm never going to take shots at, at you because at you. guess what? People can also also get better. Yeah. You can go yeah. for voice training. You can do some mm. things and you might you might get better. And with the way music is done in 2024, you can have song a viral like moment. you can have songwriters. You can you know. Yeah. I mean, there are a lot of things that can make you su- 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 successful. What about you, Smith? Do you think that how do you have you ever had like met someone and you be like, oh, this person is not talented, and you tell the person? So I'll give you two scenarios. <laughs> I got balance for this. I got balance for this one. I'll give you two scenarios. So one part of the essentials of being an E N R, yeah, is one being diplomatic. Being diplomatic. Yes, you have to be diplomatic as an E N R, and also knowing when to be diplomatic. So last week, we, like, two, we had obviously I can't mention names. Yeah, of we had an artist that came to the office. Yeah. Requested for, you know, saw the bogaz, you know, I need, to, I need to have a camp, I want to release music, ah, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Unfortunately for me, they assigned it to me. Unfortunately. And wow. Then, I say unfortunately because... And unfortunately. <laughs> it was wow. quite unfortunate because I had heard the person's music before. Prior. And you were not impressed. And I was, it, that's, like, I already knew that I was no career for this person. And then I was like, you know what? Based on say, you don't already reach my table. Let me see what I can do. So let's pause there. Yeah. So somebody, an artist walks in and speaks to the bosses and the bosses now assign them to you. You can't tell the boss that this person does not have talent. That's what I'm saying. I would tell the boss. I mean, what's, 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 what's talent? What's uh, talent? Melody. Melody, talent is... Subjective. So, 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 so you can't yeah. say this person is not good enough yeah. for what us. What if it's the Smith thing? What if it's Smith Exactly. That, what that is my really ear? the talent that, of this ex- person. Do you know? What if it's Ujima I mean, has... And I think that with the chain of command or hierarchy, Smith... The bo- Smith's bosses are, have like 10 okay. to 15 years experience. experience. They, they so if they work. think that it, it works, it, it, it works. Have any choice, you know? So my job is then now to like <laughs> make it work. Make it work. And wow. if you cannot work, Omo, you know, go for you, my bro. <laughs> like I, I, we finished everything. Yeah. And I had to like call the person to call, the side. No, no, I didn't even call the person. I got to call the bosses first. Say, this is this is how it is. My own opinion is that there is no career going yep. forward. There's no part. And respectfully, my bosses understand now. This is how it is. But yeah, I called the person. Now and tell. And I told the person, see this. Wow. Maybe you might not be good in music. You might be good in fashion. Or, or tech. Or I tech. Mean, tech is, I mean. Or artist manager. Yeah. Or something. And then the second scenario was that the same thing happened. And then I had the conversation. Mm-hmm. And it, the music came out perfectly. So, for, but for conversations like you working in that capacity of being a and people and being able to tell somebody... As a job description that people do not necessarily take seriously, yes, they and do. you get dragged every day for not having actual yes. talent yes. or any skill yes. or any know-how yes. to be able to tell anybody about what they should do and what they should not do. How do you feel championing such a career path that gets dragged every day? Do you sometimes feel like, you know what, because people say that A&Rs are not needed, maybe I need to go find something else to do. Do you get bothered by the lack of respect that comes with your office? No, I don't. It oh. doesn't bother you. It doesn't. I've, so I look at it this way. If I've been doing this for like a, a tiny minute. Tiny minutes. Okay. Give, give us time. Give us time. Like close to 10 years. You see? About Smith 10 years. No small. I've been 10 years. No, no sorry, wait, what, what? Wait, wait, wait. Yes. Wait, hold up. Wait, no, no, now let's say, wait. You've been doing what for 10 On that years. note. <laughs> On that note. Smith, just run us through your resume. Yeah. <laughs> Yes. I guess it. Wait, because I, you... I had eight years in my head. Well, I mean, ten Wait, years is Ten years of doing A&R. Quiet. No, ten years of like working in the game. No, the what, how many years have you been in A&R? A&R. About six. In and out. Wow. I'll say six. I mean, the, give like, context because... So, I mean... I'll say I mean, I mean. <laughs> so, that, I, there was even like a part where I was actually doing A&R. I didn't know that I, I, didn't know that I was Yeah, that happens a lot. That happens like, a lot. I didn't know that that was my job description. Yes, actually. I was doing something else and... And you were just yeah. doing that. I'm sure it was unpaid work. It was... Of course. Know, it was obviously now. You guys uh, do unpaid. It's Definitely. industry. We're it's teaching the, you. This well, is the part to grow. Uh-huh. So, you know... <laughs> paying you with exposure. So, yeah, like, it's... And again, I feel like a lot of people... The word A&R is so, like, overemphasized and overlushed. Because okay. like everybody's an A&R now. Yeah. Do you get? Which is why even now, I'm not even telling you I'm an A&R. Until you see me for office. So when you meet people, how do you introduce yourself? 
I'm just a guy that works, man. Just a boy. I'm just a boy that does <laughs> my thing. Boy. But if you want me to enter the exec P, I will go talk out. Uh, no so basically, you guys are highlighting that when it comes to like working with artists that don't know how talent, you guys are able to tell them that. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. Very, yes, yes. Yeah, it's just yeah, having common sense and knowing how to like implement like your words, you know. Because okay, so human beings are sensitive too. So I know that when it comes to like music and awards and stuff, like Nigerians are very particular about award system. What do you think about? the Nigerian space and the music industry space and the love for this, um, the love... Foreign... Is it, is it? Yeah, 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 for foreign recognition, particularly the Grammy. I know that last week the entire conversation people were having Grammy. was about Grammy consideration. I was, this hoping, artist. You, I was hoping you don't mention you that. You don't mention that. Ah, well, yeah. That was, yeah. It, that was a sad moment. The, all week, <laughs> I was just saying the banners, the rollouts Everybody don't for Grammy rollouts. consideration. At some okay. point, I had to probably try and check if maybe some things have changed about yeah. the Grammys. Yeah. Maybe because it's not an acknowledgement email that they got because... I don't get it. Like, Maybe why is how everybody, it works? Why is everybody really so, not? I don't know. I don't know. You guys should tell me. So, w- w- what is this Grammy consideration thing about, please? Educate me. I mean, me. to the best of my knowledge, yeah. um, putting it for context, is you submit and you are acknowledged that, okay, we got your submission. You're eligible. Yes. So, what's, what's, what's the idea for social I media? Know. I, I don't per- know. Personally, I thought maybe it was like... Uh, maybe one person's idea to just Is the Grammy use... cancel social media people? No. I'm saying... What it means for the artist. Okay. So I think I kind of felt like okay, one artist wanted to use Grammy conversation to just remind you that I dropped my project. I dropped my project. Yeah. Oh. So yes. but when so it's still PR. Say, like yes, I mean, exactly. It's still PR. With the way we call it PR, but I mean, when I now start seeing everybody, I was like, Everybody's maybe something has, has, has changed too. Because yeah. I thought for a second I don't that know. something had changed on the Grammy. But age. if it has not changed. It's, it's very sad. That means we are at, in fact... We're at a bleeding point. In fact. What do you mean by bleeding point? Because it's like, if we're now at a stage where it's almost like we're begging. We are, we are yawning. We are yawning for, like... It, it, it's, and the crazy thing is, it's not even... It's, it would be great if you say you're begging because they never see you. You get, if Afrobeat was not even in the spotlights and we're begging for recognition, do you understand? It's cool. It's cool or no? But Afrobeat is number one right now. Where? No, actually, technically. In Africa. No, we're, 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 we're saying that we, we have reached mainstream. We've reached main, we've, we've like, got into a America that was the hardest of the market. Yeah, we don't have to like, formally actually introduce ourselves We've actually some presence. Some presence. So we're not Let's new. Not say. Yeah. Yeah, some presence. I mean, I mean we're, but we're, we're not new. We're now. not new anymore. We don't have to like publicly... like. Present ourselves. New. People are getting three nominations at the Grammys. At the Grammys. So it's impressive. Okay, so you so you don't think that that entire situation of that is necessary or is needed? It's not necessary. It wasn't. Bro, if you if they did not the bar, if the bar did not call you, the ground. <laughs> like it's not even. <laughs> it's not even. It's like it's below. You get which one? Who I see? Lucent the fire enter. Like, I, see, I see black bones. This thing. I just I see different different people. Okay, I don't know, man. So, maybe, okay. maybe. What, what? Maybe somebody will correct us. I know that. Uh, no, somebody will definitely. Go. No, it's coming. Okay. It's coming. So, I know that the Grammy nominees are going to announce it soon. Yes. Yeah. Well, well, of in course. a couple of weeks. And again, we might be wrong. Oh. If you be still announcing John Soap. And I want to be wrong, please. I actually want to be. To what, be what, what release dropped recently that you think should, deserves to get that Grammy? What release are you single rooting for? Single or project? For? Project, single. Which are you rooting for from our Nigerian artists that you feel like this one? I I want to see it grab that Grammy. Ah, uh, mm. I guess I guess go to my show. Yes, like and what's your favorite release this year? It's 2024. So again, I think that looking at releases this year, right, and just so that I don't have any recency bias and and all of that is yeah. that I think Arasta really did well. Mm. Yeah. Thank you very much. About to as, you know as the right project there. going on and on. You know, the fact that, you know, um, shout out to David o, the way Timeless Run was like a full-blown yeah, full blown campaign. campaign and it had an ending, you know. Mm-hmm. Understanding that and seeing that at this point, mm-hmm. artists in 2024, I don't know why, but I think mm-hmm. it's not intentional. Yeah. For some reason, maybe they just forget that they release the project mm-hmm. or they don't have like significant... Um, um, strategies that they will use to re-up because it's about when you drop obviously the first one month 
is all hey, hey, hey. Yeah. Yeah. After a while, after a while kind of everybody, somebody else yeah. drops and all of that. So I think it's 2024. Ashake is really doing well, you know. Ashake be on Ashake um, be on a, I think his project is something to to look into. Collaborations are really solid. The Sonics are really good. So I think Ashake won. Aya Star, yeah. I think those two. Um, yeah. For Wait, for the Grammys, for yeah. The Grammys. In 2024. 2024. Yeah. So That's for you, Ashake, Aira, what yeah. about you? For the Grammys, I think. Obviously, I'll see Aira Star. I'm even going to try and, Aira you know, Star. I think Aira Star's project was pretty was pretty impressive. Um, Do you think Thames, Thames, Thames should to be considered? I mean, I, yeah, was, sure. I think she should be considered, but, yeah. but I can't say it to my chest because I honestly did not listen to Thames. Okay, and another thing is that, I mean, for me, I think, yes, Thames, because, I mean, she has, like, the international collaboration. You're doing agenda. You're doing agenda. Don't answer that. I mean, she, has, she has the international appeal, mm-hmm. you know, um, but from a grassroots level. An impact for an album. Yes. Like, again, it's not a Nigerian platform, so yeah, that's, that's the thing. That's, that's the thing. <laughs> and that's the we always forget. The metrics yeah. are, are not, kind of different. You know, the the like their whole style is different. Yeah. Like, the metrics, the method in which like they consider, you know, above or with Aside the speculations that we you know we heard, but I shall care for sure, honestly. I shall, I shall care for you guys for there. It's for sure. And yeah, I want to say Rebel too. To yeah. The Rebels project. I forgot Rebel. Of course. <laughs> no, on because Zemba, uh, on Zemba, oh, no, 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 no. Zemba, I forgot. 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 Zemba, I Zemba, I forgot. 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 Zemba, I I d- bad. Those ones, they good, they're right. But those are that ones. So you, so you really think that Rema, like Rez, like Rema's album, he is should like. Yeah, be yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. Should, it was if you don't like it, that's what. But I think that should be considered as a project, that, you know. Okay. Um. So. And please, if you're saying Ashake, which one? Which Ashake project? The long, this, this, this one, yes, boy. Is it not? I don't be legible. Legible. Work of art is the one for me. Yes, that, I think that, 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 that has passed. I think yeah, but if I was to put an Ashake project for forward for that, that, that it's, it's again, I mean, it's an. <laughs> I feel like a lot of people don't pay re- respect to this album. Mm-hmm. This one, it's Lungu Boy. Boy. Because yeah. of the success of the other ones. Mm. Yeah. That one is just okay. I think it's just the sound. Sophomore album was good. Yes, love it. I mean, I, I think Remember is on the chart now. Yes, it's no, back, Remember is back on the yes, chart. It is, it so, but don't, don't, don't. Step out of the juice. It's the same person that is delivering. I know this. And see, again, they don't give this album credit because of the fact that, like, this guy stepped out of his box and connected with people. Everybody hmm. connects now. Who don't connect? It's not but, easy. And I, and I also feel like when it comes to the music, when we're talking about like albums that should make Grammy consideration or like albums that should make it to the Grammys, yeah. we're always very focused on like mainstream albums. Or no. albums yes, that definitely. we know oh, that. Oh, that's one of those that is not really... Like, definitely. but you don't also feel like company. there are some... I feel like we should also focus on, like, quality. Yeah, and yes, now. Of course. Especially by uh, mainstream uh, artists. But, but, but you, you will not blame us. You will not blame us. Yeah, why, because... Why would we easily go so for mainstream, mainstream guys, because like Ira, we are mainstream because we think that you have some presence in some market. But, so, for albums, like, for me, I feel like, what about albums that are not, like, from the most popular artists uh, me, that we... Like, them should them camp. Yes, them yes. I, I think that... Did you just call Shodem Camp from your chest or was there somebody in your ear? <laughs> Answer me now. Smith, I hate you. No. <laughs> to be honest, Toby has been shouting Shodem Camp, but... Because he, I know the devil he, is somewhere that's he, calling, whispering it. in my ear. I, I you know, <laughs> Yeah, it's really, it's really it. I heard from the father has been saying it. Um, I genuinely think that Shodem Camp does really good music. Yes, I, they no, do. I don't, think they, I don't think they don't do good music. Yeah. I think they're... Really like great. Have Maybe just the publicity. I don't think they no, put it. No, the publicity. Yeah. Like, good music is good music. It's surface regardless. Yeah. Like, you said, like, I respect you in terms of, like, the way you put out music. Like, the way you yeah. listen to music. Yes, so, I, show I them, agree. If you say show them come now, I can respect that. Now, Melody probably listened. But I'm saying it now. Did you say it because of your chest? or? No. So, first and foremost, 
I am a show them camp fan girl. Okay, good. Away from this show them camp and cavemen, I literally be at the Pan Wine music every other time and That's just nice. be there. That's I nice. really yeah. genuinely That's like nice. the music. <laughs> so I it's too. not really about, yeah. So it's not I necessarily, too. with or without this collaboration with cavemen, show them camp is solid. Yeah, I show, think no, that no, no, when no. it comes to, actually, I used to listen to show them camp. I feel like when it comes to rap distracted. music, I, as a person, I've said the countess, and I'm not the biggest rap music fan, especially the ones that we all this don't aggressive. Like rap music. Huh? But you don't like rap music? No, I don't. I don't. I don't like rap. I don't like bri 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 bri. I'm not really about that one. And uh, I also feel like the rap that we do in Nigeria. Sometimes we're always trying to sound like people that are doing. No, no, you're not just energy. a rap head now. Do you they're already doing said that a, now. Uh, I'm not that. The thing goes. I'm not. I don't want to go scrap anywhere. So you, so don't, like, you don't like. Wait, you don't like um, psycho YP. So show them camp does. Answer rap, the question now. Show them camp does rap music Melo, that I like. Melody, did you like psycho YP? So show them camp. Those are like my guys. Melo, did you like psycho YP? I really like Melo, did you like psycho YP? So, Melo, did you like psycho YP? So I feel like, yeah, shout out to him. He's doing good in He's his, doing good. In so, his but Melody, I want to ask, um, show them camp, yes. Psycho YP, God bless I, you. I, 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 I like, I like their, their music. Yeah. But do you think for an award like the Grammys, I, I mean, it depends on the metric again. Yeah, yeah. You know, so, I for one, why, and you mentioned, oh, why do we always keep to the mainstream guys? Yeah. And, uh, I just think, I mean, we, from our own end, want to be able to understand that, okay, this thing is mainstream and it's popping in other places. Affection that's Nigeria. why there's yeah, that's why we put it up as first. Yes, that's just my own I agree 100%. Ideology, I 100%. Well. And also because, like, I don't know what people are saying. I think that that speech that Tyler made during when she received her um, Best Afrobeat uh, Song one. Award or something, <laughs> where she made reference to the fact that Africa is beyond Afrobeat. I think that's a profound conversation. Because because of the fact that you think Afrobeat yeah. is the only genre. Yeah, there are so many is. other genres. Yeah. And I remember when Whiskey dropped his body of work. Um, the la- um, yeah, was made it? in Lagos or M- M- L- more love. No, 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 made in Lagos. When people were saying that for Grammy category, it shouldn't be just about Afrobeat. That, that album and maybe like Essence should have made it to best R- R&B. 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 Do you understand? Yeah. So I feel like we should be able to have music from Africa or Nigeria that is not just in best African But do you think music. that was what Tyler was talking about? No, she was speaking like, generally about Africa. Because it felt like she was just saying, okay, Decentralize the Nigerians or Afrobeats as they should. Yes, they I should. agree too. But I'm, I'm saying, but you are looking at it from a more. Well, I also feel like as a South African, I would feel that way yeah. because I'm doing good. I'm but, doing my piano. But do you I'm think it was the right timing to say that? Anytime is the right time to say to say anything you want to say. Because so that, that was the conversation. Like it felt really tricky. I think it's, a, it's an important stage to even have that conversation. What should she say it on so, on Instagram? But on what did Instagram. she win for? <laughs> Best Afrobeat. So does that mean she can't say that? <laughs> so I mean, I, I, mean, I feel like right. She can take right, the award and still say what she got to say. Bro. Right topic, wrong platform. I don't agree. I don't agree. Right, I don't, right, I don't right agree. topic, wrong platform. I actually don't agree. At the end of the day, I, I get her mind. and I totally understand. In fact, as a Nigerian, I understand where we are always looking to be all over everywhere. Yes, now we are the ones that, one you know. Till today, I have a question. Do you think, I mean, there's um, house music, yeah, and there was Ama Piano on the grassroots level there, yeah. like Kabza, Kaps, all, all of them. Thing, yeah. Um, do you think, I'll mention Mayor Kuhn, do you think he actually is responsible for like trying it in the Ninja Piano way? Maybe not with responsible. With that of Lele, of Lele, Maybe of not Lagos. responsible, but he played yes. a very important Good. role. Yes. Or Thank you very much. Very, of me, because very I, I can role. I can remember I think it was immediately after lockdown or lockdown, I think twenty twenty yeah. yeah, ish. Yeah. So it was like, oh I have a song. Everybody where, knows that, like people, yes. I'm just but trying to The only problem is that because he's not as forget. big as other artists that like jumped on Ama Piano. Mm-hmm. So when people talk about Ama Piano and, and they don't think they don't think about they always say David Doe because David Doe is like the biggest and that was champion sound. Even was it champion sound? No, it wasn't he was featured. Not what? K-Star remix. The case, no, yes, no. That, okay, K-Star. I can't remember. The, it goes down with my yes, K-Star Yes, K-Star remix. Yes, 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 that was the first one. Yeah, that was the first one. So I, and yeah, yeah, then Champion Sound. So I feel Champions like the video... Champion Sound was his, but yeah, he did K-Star. 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 So the video literally was... played, like, made it very popular yes. and big in Nigeria. I shout out to Wiz and Bonner. They were but on... Then, they were on... We have been talking about... Oh, no, no. Yes. Please, like... Are we forgetting that Runtown played a big part in the Apartment Fury? But is it Ama Piano or just being music from South Africa? Ama Piano. So what song is that? Ah. What song? With, with Runtown is Party 99. No, no, no. What's the one we did with... Is it Uhuru? Uhuru is Davido. 
Thank you. Is it, are you sure? Is that not my piano song? I can't remember yes, what no. that sounds like. I can't remember I what can't that sounds like. I can't remember Oh. Uh-uh. Yeah, Banga, but... Banga is not a piano. I'm a I don't know what... I can't remember I don't know if like. Banga is on a piano. I would have to... Re- it's not. Releasing. Uh-uh. But was Banga before the collaboration with Bonner and Wiz? Yes. yes. It was way before then. Let's find out. Let's find out. So, so Banga dropped... But it's nice to know because... Yes, no. I, I, just, I just see that and think... Thing. I'm like... Yes, we have run with this whole Niger piano. Because I, I call it Niger piano. Niger. Niger. I don't think we do... Yes. I'm we don't. Actually, we don't actually do Amapiano. Do if it. you hear the real <laughs> Amapiano, you'll be cuckoo, happy. Cuckoo, cuckoo. What about you'll the hear about it? No. It's actually not Nanja it. It's actually it <laughs> not it. Nanja Piano. Spice it up. It's not it. We just Shout out to Nigeria. And that's what I'm very do, that's I'm very happy. That we have artists like Kala that are saying no, no. I'm happy too, but I'm just saying that I don't know. It's just the wrong time. I beg, give people should rest. Best Afro beat. Then you come as nasty. She can create oh, that word and still educate Afrobeat. you people. I don't. I, don't I feel like it's because it's Tyler. That's why. That's why you are saying no, that. No, I really, really see. see no man, I don't even like Tyler. For me, I just feel why? like everybody will have a great deal. Okay, I, why don't you like her? Um, uh, I know just yeah. like the baby. I think she's amazing. Oh, as, I, mean, I, like I don't see. Yeah, I like her. Yes. Yeah. It was. Like Nigeria has just somehow exactly like are you people serious? Let South Af- let our South Africans talk about their piano as much as they, sh- as they, they want. should. As I they think should. they should. Like as they should. Come shouting Afrobeat everywhere and everybody wants wants to call Shout out to Gabza. Shout out to Shout out to Gabza. Shout out to those guys doing what they got to do. Nah, those are like like South Africans do man. not play with their piano. Yeah, and they it's don't. good. And why this guy? Now? Yeah, one time with this guy, see this guy they cry for. They say with the with the up the listen. Nobody who will be that. Yeah, be like the BPM. The BB. They do the BPM. Yes, okay. Yeah, he went on Instagram live. Yeah, guys. He said, guys, I beg. I this beg. Not this is not a my piano. And that was I wish you no listen to him. And, that, and that's such a valid conversation. No, no, no. For me, I think Nigerians are very, like, in, the, very in, in this world. We're so think, egoistic. If I was God creating very. the universe, Nigeria is an ab- anomaly. <laughs> We're very somehow. Like Nigeria was just a glitch. It was a glitch like, in imagine the system. Like, imagine they're dragging for correcting you about his own stuff. Do you understand? Yeah. Yeah. Say, well, how dare you? You're not well, happy. You we know, made it popular. I'm like, are you poor That's kid? who we are. That's who we are, man. That's who we, that's are. Who we are. Anyways, do you guys think that the bar is on the ground when it comes to music, the entrance of artists when it comes to music? Yes. Entrance? What, what, what do you like say? Like, like Oh, memorable? Yeah. No. Okay. Do you think the bar is on the ground when it comes to music and the people that we allow in and we call artists and musicians? Of course, yes. It was, the bar is not even on the the floor. No, there's a bar. A skit. It's a just that somebody okay. buried it. A content it. creator it had in about one song. That was the day. <laughs> that was the day. Do you guys have something against content creators becoming like no. artists? No. We've established on this board that people are allowed to create. Create. But oh. where, you know, like you should be, be able to... Draw a line. Yeah, no, not draw a line. Separate real artists. Like, what are you doing? Like why did this? Because I won't consider again, certain people are is is about this Even system. With songs. You know when it comes to marketing song. right now, hmm. music marketing in Nigeria needs to have like a, like an overhaul. Like we need to actually sit ourselves down hmm. and ask ourselves where are we going. What's going on? Yes. yes, influencers are charging even more than well, if you check how much you paid for mixing, mastering, artwork. Yes, they're charging more. Absolutely. 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 We are, we, are, we are in a crisis. <laughs> Ask anybody. Forget artists that are not really saying that artists that have the marketing budget, the yes, funding. Bread, the so this influencers, like TikTok or Instagram. Yes, or and that was where it even came from because the only reason why a content creator would think that, oh, I, have, I can be able to do this is because they have a system. There's a pipeline. I, I know that over the years, I've collected X amount of money to promote X person, mm-hmm. person and I know what those did, reach were. The numbers. So I'm like, to, so it's almost a like content has creator has a, a, a label a now that has an artist that he pushed and by virtue of metric, they, they've, done, they've done well. But I'm not sorry. Like I'm, I, not, I'm not also so, so, sorry, so, but so I'm like, saying I'm not, that... I'm not sorry that TikTok I'm, influencers, wait, okay. be charging... You know, an arm and, and they're not leg. just only TikTok. Or with like for you people's marketing, IG. you guys be like be paying all of this money and yes. all of that because it's the same artists that don't revert traditional media. So the one that you revert pay. Yeah, absolutely correct. And oh, this one is this one is going down. You won't blame you artists blame too. Down. Consumer behavior also affects. Affects. Mm-hmm. Now, what am I saying? 
there was a time where if you put my song on the radio, that's oh, okay. I'm done. Oh, good. Like, please. Put my song Period. because, I mean, what's the science of radio? It's like hypnotizing somebody. Mm -hmm. You re-up it and re-up re it and re-up yes, it. Yes, and yes. For some reason, Create you just say yes. Yeah. The audience. So, but at the time, people left and there's this, forgetting that they call it now, when you scroll your phone and you're not looking, you're not, you not paying scrolling, attention yeah. anymore. Yes. Something, you know, and you realize that, okay, you, you now understand that the, our, our attention is now on social media. People are on their phones too. For, they've not eaten. I, I think, yeah. They are on their phones. Problem. They wake up, they've not said a word. They're yeah, on their phones. I know people like that. Do you understand? <laughs> And at the end of the day, oh, so if you're an ar artist and you're trying to promote your craft or your, mm. your, your product, you are going to look for, okay, where is it really buzzing? Mm -hmm. Mm. So shout out to traditional media and I agree with you because, again, that's why even the award thing that we're yep. discussing now is a problem. Is going up? Mm. So do you think mm. maybe, maybe if you guys spend less time on your phones, this, we won't have this problem? I agree. Yes. So how do we get one, people to spend less one, time on their phones? But number two, at the core of it is, hmm. please, Nigerians, appreciate good music. Hmm. You don't actually appreciate good music. Appreciate good music. You don't. Hmm. It's important. I agree. I agree. Like... So now, on that conversation of the bar and music and everything... Yeah. There's a conversation... So do you guys follow BB Ninja? No, I, uh, I didn't follow this last one. Why do you think people are not watching BB Ninja this year? What do you think yeah. is the problem? I mean... I have a theory. What's the theory? the theory? Is What's the theory? I think people are a lot distracted now with reality. Hmm. T pain. <laughs> T pain. I think people are distracted. T pain. I think people are coming to the re reality of like, because in the previous years, in the previous years, you know, we had like, obviously, we've we'll been suffering for a while. Things wow. Have been <laughs> oh my God. You know? I imagine <laughs> understanding <laughs> that you've been suffering. <laughs> wow. We're speaking economically, right? Wow. Yes. As a nation, if you want to say, start with that, no problem. Okay. <laughs> so it's not only that. It's not only that. Please go it's on. It's not. Too. Oh Remember my that. god. <laughs> I think people have started to realize that more. This thing where they watch. Hmm. This thing finished like it's this crazy. Time. I'm back to square one. Like there's no food in the It's kitchen. done, man. So it's like, and I think it's good. Is that? Yes, that people are starting to like wake get up, aware, face reality, because. I look at BBN Niger and other platforms mm -hmm. as a drug. As a drug. This takes you, gives you an escape. You know? Escapism. An escape. Yeah. You know? People need, Nigerians need an escape. No, we, yeah. So that's why. Even and it's bad most, and good. Yeah, yeah good. It's like a double edged sword. Because on the flip side, it's humorous for us and it relaxes us. It gives us like. That is kid that we need. On the other side. other side, it is detrimental to us because we're not taking things seriously. Hmm. You hmm. know? So, wow. Fuel is how much? Fuel now? is now like 1,000 one, one, one one thousand something. One, one. I, I bought for 1,100. You know? 100. And Melody, they're telling me. For context. For, for context. We're buying at 140. One, and, 140 we're and we're so complaining. So it's like a hundred percent. Because it's one one to one, like yes, now that's one hundred percent. It's not one thousand. That's over. That's over. Hundred percent is an increase. Is that two hundred and something? Is it not? Is that now? So we. I'm sorry. If we buy something for one hundred and something. There's a there's a zero there now. Okay, my math is bad. Okay, yeah. Me, I don't even say me. I don't follow the There's a, there's a zero there. So it's like if you add one zero, it's one four. Exactly. So that's the hundred that we're talking about. So if you're buying fuel for one, go on, go on with your analysis. You know. So it's like. It's just that whole space is not being filled anymore. Yeah. And the timing at which these things are being like pushed for consumers to take on, inherit, pass away time with mm -hmm. is terrible. I you actually think saying? that it's terrible. You should know when to stop. You should know when to stop some things. You should know when to stop. I, it dawned on me even today because I was at the gym today. And this is in bad way. One of these in bad way boys. Yeah. Mm. They were the gym too. No, I saw. I see one of them. The only reason why I know one of them because I know their sister. That one. I see the guy. Normally I know say 
if one of these big brother people don't come out, they, they, they boss, they always they like, Afa, mm, nobody send the guy papa. Like, nobody gave a fuck. So it's just like, like, what's going on? So you guys didn't say, hi, can I get an autograph? Me. Which I think in this, on this edition, no, I mean, like, the, aside the, from you, of course, I know you will not, but did anybody like say hi? No, the, people the don't only, move in about, don't their life. about their day. The only like, person that actually got real clout is Wana. I don't even know. Wani, sorry. One, the, the twins. The twins. The twins, the one that no, almost all, won. But all of them be twins now for the. No, be the whole no the they show. were in, in pairs. Oh, like, okay, I think all of them, they kind of. No! no. Uh-uh. You see, that's how. So it's not even that's how nobody can no. say them carry twins. They are the only twins. They are the only twins, but they are just in pairs. Oh, one okay, those DJ girls. Yes, yeah. those DJ girls. So I think it's only one that I feel like has like, like this court following yeah. and all of that. You said what? Do I sign? No, no, I ask. Do I sign? Did they go to? Do I sign? But the point I'm trying to make sure is that so I so the reception was just very bland. Yeah, yeah, it was. It was. So. I'm not thinking like so. Imagine you going to BB Nigeria, you now come out, yeah, and you're not getting and, that. And that. you think that is a life changing moment that. for you, yeah. And you just come and everybody's like, but wow. I think it, it doesn't start with them. Two, three, yeah, it started to fade away. ago. People went there with 8k following, came out with 12 or 9k before yeah. you have like 200 before you would go like, 100 you know. or yeah. Both platforms, though. So now the, the 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 person that won for this year, his um his name is Kelly Ray. I don't, I don't they finished know his name. now. Yeah, they finished, but. An unknown person won it. His name is Kelly Ray. No, but they finished. Yes, they're done. I did, I didn't Man. know him. But his name is Kelly Ray. I wasn't Sha. following, but I knew Wani. Oh my god. The point is, he who won. Was, who was the, the winner? Who, 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 Kelly who, Ray! Who, they who, sat the who, winner inside that like was it final? They not pick yeah. they not said, oh, go into the house and be the winner. I don't know, yeah, who, but who be I want sorry, Robert. Who be Wani? Wani the DJ the now. Hani, uh, Hani and Wani. They be DJs, they be twins. Yes. yes. So now twins should then do now. No. no. Pairs. Like you, you and your friend can come in. Like this man that won, he entered with I'm his one, wife. I'm the one drinking. You are the one. No, now they ask you now, but she just said twins. They, oh yeah, no problem. No, the good. person that entered, they, no, they entered in pairs. It's not to be I twins. I just want to know who the one people did. They entered in pairs, but they were just like the man that won. Now he entered with his wife as his partner. Yes. His so that couple partner. win the thing. Wait, yes. Mad. Uh, the guy is married. Yes. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, anyway, the point I'm trying to make sure is that he's an artist. He is? He's an artist. Yes. And did you know before the show? No, I found out on the show. And so after you watched Big Brother? No, no I didn't. She just watched the I just, finale. Yeah. I didn't even watch the finale. I just hear these things. I just see it on social yeah, media. No, really so he's an artist. And the question that I saw, people were saying that guy, this Kelly Ray, as he has won this thing now, he should not go and use his money to do musical. Like she just focus on maybe oh, wow. rebranding. They should call names. They, they, they should call names. names. Like who? Like who? So I'm. Um, <laughs> yes, let's so let's, 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 let's have a conversation. Let's talk about yes. I mean, let's have please, that conversation. Feel free. Are ready now? Melody, feel so free. So the point. Yeah. guys, been a spice of the So the point I'm trying to make with this is that. The, the BB Ninja to music pipeline, pipeline is where I'm trying to speak oh, on. Yes. So now, Kelly Ray conversation is before we go into that pipeline, guys, we're going on a quick break. Uh, uh, but don't forget that we're still talking. Yes, don't forget to grab your popcorn, <laughs> grab your chicken. Can your you allow chips, her to do, her, do you know? her thing? No, no, no. The uh, podcast is still going uh, on, oh, and you will get the full episode on Monday. Uh-huh. We're just going on a break on TV, and still, of course, the full thing drops on Monday. Your favorite streaming platform. The entire conversation is going to be on Monday. But right now, we're going on a break on TV. Don't forget that this is still Zero Conditions Podcast, brought to you by Pop Central. Truth. It's, uh, it's a lifestyle show. Mm-hmm. I mean, <laughs> and I think out. that, yes, you can say yourself, oh, you're an artist and, and all of yeah. that, but at the core of, of it, the people that would sit to watch lifestyle that are committed to that kind of platform mm. are not necessarily interested in mm. like you sing it, except you are. I mean, I think maybe along the line, somebody will break that jinx. cycle. Yeah, that jinx and, and all. But for now, what we can see is that your the talents that we've seen so far aren't convincing enough yeah. to actually break through. So is it, the, is it the talent itself or is it the show? Yes, the show is the, is the talent. That is, is the mixture of everything. Because where I'm going is that... Is it the show? Your job as a contestant that went there as an artist and you came out with the exposure that you have, you are trying to convert people that watch Lifestyle to actual 
music list like mm. music listeners like streaming audience streaming audience yes yeah trying to convert yeah, them to believe to you to numbers. as an artist I'll take you seriously I'll take you seriously yeah. you know so that's that's it that's a huge job and I, and I genuinely think that for some, for some of the guys now, like for what money, when he was in the house, he was really doing his cooking thing. I feel like if he had come on to like yeah, start a restaurant felt, and just be doing food, well, I feel said, like that would have been said, a good you thing. Yourself. Everybody felt the same way. You said. What? You know. No, but I, I think you would have been a very successful cook. I mean, that. I'm, I'm no, very no, sure people told him. You come out to the, you deviate from your calling. <laughs> Who? Who? Don't worry. Did that go to Bibi Ninja? No. No, be you are the full talk. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. okay, okay, okay. okay I, like I, it's, I, it's like a cycle. Like a cycle. Yes, I, I, I hear that. I hear but that. also, and I think that it's even in the music space, you all be just be asking these guys to come in with their money and invest in the music, and the money will just go poof. Nobody, Ooh, asks, nobody, asks, nobody asks you to come and invest. Well, Please, you know. let's put that there. Nobody Please. beg you make come invest. Disclaimer. Nobody Disclaimer. Asks Disclaimer. Nobody is asking to invest. I don't, we don't know what Melody is talking about. I don't know what. No, but that makes no sense. But won't you, okay, so if the artist were to come to you guys and say, okay, we want to do music, won't you put ask them for, for money? Thank you very much. Why can't you tell them that? Oh, I don't Thank think you should. Thank you very much. Now, for calm that down. Question. Let's we have two of us here. We'll give you a Let's break it down. It's music business. Melody, there's what we call an injection phase. Mm hmm. You understand for each of our clients. Okay. Now, when you come in, you're an artist, you have money, we'll first sit you down. Be like, yo, relax. You understand? What have you recorded? What do you have going on? You understand? We try to see where we can come in. You understand? And, and that's where the honesty comes, where you ask us, how do you, you know, yeah. navigate being a... So, we are not going to say, bring your money. And mm. with what we've seen... I mean, working for a district company, then a, then a labor servicing, servicing company, company, we've seen that. I think I, I got the mail earlier today from somebody saying that, please send me your price list. So they even come with the money? Like, it's like, oh, hi, uh, da 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 company, da 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 Send me your price list. I need social media engagement, huh. um, this thing streaming. For real. Huh. I was so... You see that the narration is even. Like I was so it's it's, 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 it's what we face on it on it on a daily mentality. basis. Yes, the mentality is poor. It's like, do you think you can just buy your way through things? Through the music industry, it doesn't work that way. And I sat in and I and I and I composed <laughs> composed the <laughs> response, following up with a deck to to let him understand. I'm like, this is how it goes. We our services are strategy based. It's not there's no price list anywhere. It is tailored to your needs. A person. You understand? As an artist, you are unique in your own way. There's something you need. You understand? And at the end of the day, that's what people... So what you are trying to say is that there are people with, with loads of money that just feel like they want to do Can't music. They don't, sorry. The they don't there? have any knowledge about it. Mm -hmm. They are not patient to want to build anything. Mm -hmm. You understand? They just want to mm -hmm. jump in. Okay, so in that music space and money conversation, I also yeah. saw, I think it was Adair that put out a tweet where he was talking about artists asking for advance, mm -hmm. one million dollars, and da 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 da, da. Mm -hmm. What is the, did you see the tweet? I think Adair has spoken about something like that. Yeah. Do you guys have artists who come with those kind of ask? Yes. No matter. What, no what is an unrealistic and what is a realistic money to ask for for advance? It's very simple. <laughs> <laughs> no man, maybe it's just me. Music business is very easy. Mm -hmm. Like it's simple. Just as an artist, you believe you are a business, right? Mm -hmm. You're a bankable artist. Mm -hmm. Before you talk anything, before advance comes from your mouth, mm -hmm. you have to be a bankable artist. Do you have ROI? Mm -hmm. Do you, can can you have return on it? How much do you make monthly from your entire platform? Mm -hmm. Do you understand? Do you even make up to a thousand dollars across all streaming platforms in a month? What's that's your, when you what's, talk. What's your engagement? That's like? when you talk about that advance. You know, what's your what's your currency like? How what's the value that you have? Because again, advances are in so many, so many categories. categories. Some people are eligible for just five k. You understand? But you have to know where you stand. You don't come around, you cannot boast of a 
$500 revenue in a month and you come out and say you want a 50k advance how is that supposed to happen so the advance when you give them the advance yeah. it means that you so explain that advance thing yeah. for people that don't understand so when you I say mean, when you say I give an artist you advance want, you want me to borrow you money because you can make it back is it borrow yeah it's borrow it's basically, we're basically borrowing you money but you, so money. The will we're pay, believing in you so, you, so they'll pay back by normal revenue. your your streaming royalties streaming if revenue. I give you money in advance the streams coming, we we set the royalty split in the favor of me, your your investor. Usually, if you are distributing the standard, is it that 80, 20 in the favor of the artist, yes. right? So, but now leave my suya now. But now, <laughs> please focus, uh, Melody. But now, you when I give you an an advance, right? We would have to adjust that ratio. So, so for when, me to be able to recoup. So when you give somebody advance of fifty k dollars, so that person will not make money off their streaming for until that. 50K for a while, yes. Until for you a get while, your yes. money back. Until you make your money. No, they will be getting, but I'll but be getting more. More until Just when you, my fifty k. Yes, yes, yes. Is, yes. So yeah. My fifty k is never complete, uncle. Yes, that's why things don't. I mean, it's, it's, it's the music <laughs> business. So what we ask for one million? There's How bad, there's back? bad debt. There's a lot of other other thing. Yeah. That, so do they know that the money is not as from from a company perspective? We are looking to say, okay, three or four in ten would recoup. Then the and rest we'll have bad enough to make it right, up. Right, right. So are you saying now that on a, you know how a lot of times the conversation is always about how record labels, distros, labels yeah. be taking advantage of artists, be giving them bad deals and stuff. As the people that work in such organizations, and now you're basically establishing that they are bad Debt. losses, yeah, bad debts or yeah. something. Are you saying that sometimes these record labels do not make the money back? A lot of record sometimes labels do not make money back. But we just hear a lot of times of artists being taken adv advantage of. Yeah, I mean, when an artist say they are, they, they've been taken advantage of, you, you now look, look into the scenario and, and realize that even the person that is advancing doesn't know what is going on. We've had cases where people just set up record labels or set up platforms and they're advancing artists without mm -hmm. even going through enough due, due diligence there's no research there's like no literally development nothing. there has to be due diligence done okay who is this artist what is their what is their resume like okay what how many monthly li listeners do they have now yeah. what is their conversion rate on social media all of that like okay even down to unreleased music mm -hmm. Okay, do you do you even have product that you are working with? Like, is are you confident that this artist has enough record to you know go and go and go? Is this artist talented enough to keep going to the studio and recording? These are all factors. But when you guys give these artists this money, do you guys let them know that is it like they're going to pay back? Do you guys do other education? Do yes. you guys allow? Because I also feel yes. like sometimes record labels, you guys don't let the artists be coming with their lawyers. You guys Again, just have to bamboozle I mean, them into I mean, whatever. If not that, we just disclaimer. Sorry. Okay. Like. Any establishments, mm -hmm. service, DSP, mm -hmm. label, that does not allow you yeah. to have a conversation without legal advice, yeah. does not have your best interest at heart. Let's just put that out there. <laughs> okay. You always advise. Now go get your own lawyer. Have a lawyer. If you don't have one... We can assign some people, some establishments can assign a lawyer to you. I don't even think that labels should assign lawyers to artists because whatever label, whatever yes, lawyer you're assigning to the like artist, maybe you're yeah. looking out for yourself. Yeah. Because yeah. the artist should have their own lawyers outside of whatever I'm, the label is put, I'm speaking providing. on situations whereby the artist, the artist, artist cannot, artist does not even have, have the, the capital, resources, the resources to, to even to get, to get the services that of the lawyer. Okay, because let's not lie, this even person. lawyers are not really like, <laughs> yeah, like in the industry. And, just a normal person cannot just say, oh, I'm looking for a lawyer. Like, you literally need to know a person. To know, you yeah, need person, to have connection to have, have a lawyer. You can't just pop it's up. It's not for a regular person that cannot afford it, right? I mean, it's, it, even it's not so easy. affording is even going up. It's like finding. Finding a lawyer. And understanding, okay, I cannot afford you. Even finding is... It's hard. It's, it's hard. I understand So that. we need more lawyers. I need to know that different lawyers have, like, different sectors. Yes, yes. of yeah, course. So, so in entertainment so IP, space might not be the easiest yeah. one. Yeah. Okay. I also so there's this conversation. You no, know, we spoke about the first situation yeah. and you know things being expensive and all of that. I saw a video that you know Kunle Remy, an actor, was talking about that one of the things that, about Nigerians is that we will always adjust. 
like we'll always adjust that's and I, so sad, man. And I well, think that that's it. Saying, uh, well, <laughs> like, even right. when they increase this to this, I think what she's trying to say that are we not supposed to, at what point do we stop adjusting? But I feel like it's not necessarily all the way true because in the past, we came out. We came out. And they killed we us. We have allegedly <laughs> been. Uh, yes, okay. <laughs> allegedly for the sake of. <laughs> we're cute, but we no were. Way. We were. Yeah, they had so a I physical think, altercation. I think, with so, so the, the so what I'm trying people. to say, yeah. so, so the allegedly is not even more of like whatever happened at happened. the toll gates was obvious. That's not what the alleged. The allegedly is that oh that didn't happen. Not that, but we know what happened. So for people that were present, do you get it? I think that as a young person that is living in Nigeria, what frustrates you the most about just being here? And if you had the opportunity, would you jackpot? I mean, Smith should go first. Why is the Smith that will go first? Smith, I don't know, back? because I think I, I need to, like, it's <laughs> a lot for me. I need to... I need to <laughs> What's your question, Melody? So I said that as a young person living in Nigeria, if you had, like, with everything going on here, if you had the opportunity to, will you jack back? Would, if I had the opportunity to, to jack go, back, like, if you need to I go leave? right now, it's Yeah. Out. Like, it's that, first and foremost, what frustrates you the most about Nigeria as a young One, person living here? The weather. The weather. It's too bloody hot in Nigeria. Actually, Smith falls sick a lot. Falls, it falls ill. Because of the lot. weather? I don't know. The heat strokes confuses me sometimes. Are you serious? That's one. Okay. That's one thing. The okay. heat stroke is ridiculous. Okay. Secondly, one of the most annoying things in this country is... Apologies for whoever takes this personal. Human beings, like Nigerians are the worst people to interact with. Yeah. There are people that in this country are... Genuinely, I feel like they practice being stupid. I agree. With so you. it's like, I like, do you I practice agree. being stupid or is it like a natural born talent? I agree. I, I feel like Nigerians yes. are very annoying to interact with. So I agree. that aside, if I had the opportunity to jack one now, would I leave? Yeah. No, actually, I won't. You won't. Funny enough, I've already had. I've had the opportunity. I'm not going. What? I will not go anywhere. Okay, I don't think you are. Do you have a? Do you have a family out? No, there. no, no. Do you have a, another passport? <laughs> No, no, I don't. Doesn't. Are you okay? I, so I why won't you, Jack? I need, to, I need to get this perspective. It's just go. a perspective. It's a and that's Smith for you. Smith is just a guy. So why won't you? Go anywhere. Smith has his you own. Like to, you want to live here? He has his own personal I principles. <laughs> no, no. Are you for real? No, like Smith, are you for real? Yes. But why though? Why? Why? <laughs> so. <laughs> what's that? Um, just ignore the devil in your ear. Don't mind him. But what I about you? I so, Melody, thank you for that question. <laughs> thank you so you much. Do you know? I mean, I mean, that's why I wanted him to go so, first. Yeah. So that it's out of the out way. Out of the way. Oh, my God. <laughs> as, a, as a young Nigerian, yeah. I'm highly traumatized. <laughs> and I'll give you a context. When I, when I actually oh dipped God. it. So, you know how you just drive to somewhere, anywhere in Lagos, and you just park. And when you park, you know, you have to do what you have to do when you get there and you leave. Understanding that down to the one with uniform, you actually have problem. to give them money. So, Melody, now, if I don't have money in my purse, I feel like I'm not complete. You're not, like, you like don't I feel not prepared. You're not prepared for the, for the world. I words. just forgot to withdraw. Yeah. That's how. Like, when I dipped it, I'm like, yo, Nigeria has, Nigeria has made us think the wrongest of things are just the way to live. I agree. So living in chaos is not a norm for us. I agree. Understanding that you can't beat the traffic, you know, depending on the area. Understanding that... Calculated risks. Understanding that when you get somewhere and you, you want to do something for, for the actuality of the thing, mm-hmm. you have to actually set out some money to be able to pay your way through it. Mm-hmm. Understanding that when you get to the airport... Just have a start where you are just everybody. It's like playing we Mario. Are, we are finished. Did you, Mary, did hmm. you play Mario? Of course I did. It's like playing Mario. Okay. We are finished. Like I dipped it and like wow. So so it's basically the the way of life for you. The way of life. Which needs to leave. So but for you, would you stay with Smith? I mean, personally, I'm going. If you give me the opportunity, which I'm has leaving. which has left. He has gone. Like, one thing I, I know for sure since when I was a child is that, yes, I, I'm a Nigerian. I looked at Nigeria from where it was. And I told myself that 
you see, leaving this country, hmm. right? I would never put myself in a position where I am, I am yearning or desperate to leave, hmm. and that's why I'm staying. So I would, I would like to go, but, but you see that thing where it's for me. You have to go to the church and go and give testimony or as you to sell how your property, start your visa and all of that. Yeah. No. Yeah. But why the church reference, though? Are church you... reference, because that was the height for me. Like, literally, you are in a country moving to the next one. Like, you are just you don't think Nigeria is a, You don't think Nigeria is a prayer point? Nigeria is... All the prayers that... Do you know, I grew up in a Pentecostal home. Okay. Uh, in TAC. What's the... What, what's the... TAC, so there's CAC. Okay, okay. Is, is it a white garment church? No. Okay. There's CAC, white, um, Christ apostolic. apostolic yeah. Then there's T. Okay. D, apostolic church. Okay. It's all Pentecostal. Okay. So it's not white. So every, before we leave service, pray for Nigeria. <laughs> I've been praying for Nigeria since I was. I've never prayed for Nigeria. Whatever. Actually, I'm I sorry, knew I anything. I Nigeria before. All those prayers, where are they? It didn't work. It didn't work. Like, so, Nigeria needs to start praying for itself. It is, like, it is what, like, so I think that. But do you believe yeah. in prayer as a person? Yes, ah, yes, no, definitely. Pray so you don't have to pray. So where I'm going with the whole Nigerian conversation is that, yes, prayers should be your thing as a person, but understanding that as a country, God has given us answered tools, prayer. Yes, so it's, it's, it's all us. that are just by I ourselves agree. scattering the whole thing. So Smith, I, I need to understand, and this is genuine. I feel yes. like it's been a minute since I met someone who does not have extra passport that wants to not that wants to stay in Nigeria. I mm-hmm. guess the point Uche is making about especially for like the the sometimes the desperation that comes with like put not the the desperate means that you have to go to get that jackpot thing in place, especially when you're trying to work everything out can be yeah. tiring at times and make it difficult. But for you who is very comfortable staying in Nigeria not very comfortable. No, no, I mean comfortable staying in Nigeria. Like, you, you don't have any need. You don't, you, you're not making any plans. You don't even want to relocate. Why? Don't you think, that, do, do, do you fear that in the next five years you will look at this moment and wish you did? No. No. Okay, man, you mean that you want to be by yourself, like, for the rest of your life? You don't no, want actually, to. I don't. I don't. You don't want to be by yourself. I want to be. I don't you think... want to get married and have kids? Yes, sir. obviously. No. Obvious, it's not obvious. Nobody wants to do that. Well, I, I want to. I want to be able to... And you want to do that in Nigeria? It, it doesn't <laughs> have to be a Nigeria thing. <laughs> Why is this guy here? I'm worried. I mean, it's like, if whoever it is I get married to... Yeah. Please tell them. Because I feel like whoever it is they are getting married to, if you're going to do that, they want to tie the person's destiny down. No, they can. They, if they want to relocate and leave, that's fine. And leave you here? Yes. And they'll they be that. there. They, yeah, they do of, that. Course, of course. You know. they I'm not saying Nigeria that wherever it is that, you know. Time. So, and you would like you know. to visit. Yeah, I'll visit. Does that make sense? I mean, it's not, it's not, my parents were kind of like that. So that's why you want to do it. So my, my point is that, do you think the entire situation of not wanting to be, which, of not wanting to relocate makes sense? Even forget the, the staying here and going there, whatever. Like, so you don't, you're not afraid of living in Nigeria. You don't think there's a better life, a better way to live outside of Nigeria? Yeah, but then that's, I feel like if I leave now... Who will repair the country? I'm not trying to repair the country. <laughs> Melody! Okay, Melody all the best. <laughs> all the best. I, I, I find that very insightful. I can't remember the last time Melody. I spoke to anybody. I else. just want to tell you, from the leave Smith. I'm doing that Smith right is, now. Smith is just no, on. I'm doing that. the of his own. I can't even believe <laughs> that. <laughs> like, no, no, nah. the word of his own. So what do you like about living in Nigeria? The Person- tenacity. Personally. That's what I hate the most. No, the only thing I like about Nigerians are just the spirit. Tenacity. Okay, yeah. That's what I hate. Like yeah. Tenacity. See, yeah. I hate That's it. why we can jump on I'm a piano. I'm, I'm making Nigeria. Make it's it that tenacity that is making us accept rubbish. Because sometimes Actually, you just have to stop. I you right? Too, what is you know? tenacity? I mean, to, 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 to like, My favorite thing about, about Nigeria is Nigerian food. That's it. Mm. Yeah, I was going to say that's, that's, that's the second thing. But that's, my, that's my... But I, I would not... Why I won't accept is that Melody, we've not gone everywhere. So, I agree, can we but really the, tell? The, the limited person that I've gone to have been traumatized when I didn't yes, have access to Nigeria. understandable, food. but I still think it's an entire world, it's a globe. That's some places that you might now go, you'll not be like, oh my the God. This is amazing. Is that, yes. Give, give me an example, let me think. I don't it. know, too. I don't know, too. Like where? I think Chinese food is amazing. <laughs> I mean, for you. All I'm saying is that. I think, is food, I think Jamaican food is amazing. I've when is food, food, understanding that. Uh, understanding that we prepare yeah. what nature gives to us. Do you understand? Like, in they're our very own kind rooted of way. with their. I don't think it's something that 
until I taste everything in the world, mm-hmm. then I will say, okay. I don't think I taste everything, my brother. Jamaican food. I feel, day. I feel like. Food yeah, day. You know, it's not like, yo, you know? is it pepper? Some people like pepper more than you. Yes. Is it, you know, is it grills? Is it, is it soup? I mean. But soup, I, 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 I had I saw like, one conversation on, online. So who do you guys like? The battle, battle of the soup. soup. Um, Alsa, Alsa, Ibo, Yoruba. Who, who do you think has the best I think Alsa array of soups? I'm sorry. Undoubtedly, mm-hmm. undisputed mm-hmm. Igbo soups. Ta- oh! Not, we're outside. Touch me. Not anybody we're outside. Touch me. Touch me. We're outside. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. We're outside. Anybody with the right taste bud can say otherwise. We're outside. Anybody that says otherwise has not seen the light. I've not seen light. And when you see the light, you will change. You will change. Come on. You will curtail. Should we start listing them out? Like, where do we start Come on. Where do we even start? This guy is just... Wait, like, where do we... I feel like... What's What's your favorite... Ibo soup. So now I think that, that that conversation is layered, right? When it comes to soups, because my geography might be bad. I feel like aside from the soups that we call like Igbo soups, Igbo we also soup. have soups from like, like South South. Yeah, South South. Yeah, but yeah, right. okay, let me rephrase. So, and I agree your... that you can merge them under Igbo. They don't like that, and I don't think. No, no. Food. What I'm saying, like on the soup level, on the soup level, because you have to make it down to three. There's make nothing that you make sound. You, you cannot just leave and say, okay, Ivo, Ivo, Alsa, and Yoruba. And you say, okay, there's South South soup that I like. I hear you when you say that, but I don't, just I don't, I don't, I don't in think. In terms that, of categories. I hear you, but I don't, I don't think so because it feels like erasure because those people have their own soup and they have their own nation. They have their Actually, own tribe. Uh, languages are not. Do you understand? So they are not Igbo people and they've been fighting for a time like we are not. Oh, so I think that it's time for us to actually respect they that. They fight a lot. <laughs> but truly, I also feel like South South soup is bonkers. It's crazy. Have you t- have you tried f- soup from the from the north? And from where? From the north. Shit. I I know only because I was giving birth in Sokoto, by the way. <laughs> I'm just the very. When we when we like we have soups like. So two two shinkafa. Um, I grew up eating shinkafa. I grew up eating. From the white shinkafa. soups to the. Draw soups. Yeah, we, like yeah. from like where yeah. where are we going? But funny enough, it, I it know wasn't that. Fun. I mean, the East has soups. They do. And guess what? Here I am. Oh, okra I... is the ultimate for me. Okra is the ultimate for you. That's why. That's why I just, like. I just. Wait. I've 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 tasted. I've tasted everything. Is nice. What type of it's okra great. soup? Is it okra soup mixed with ogbono or just plain okra? So soup? my own is not because people used to consider oh, seafood seafood. My own is not really like the okra soup that you really really put a lot of like red oil. Into. Okay. Yes. So it's not the plain or cross soup. Yeah, not the plain one. Okay, like with red oil. Red oil. Meat, all those yes. yes. They, don't, they don't have to add up. So it's not. Si- no. Okay. Okay. No. Plain. Red. Okra. Well. Okra. But uh, I've experienced every like every soup. Fisherman is, soup. Is so lit. It's so lit. For me, I'm, I'm just a simple Utazi. guy. I just want you to just make me okra. Okra. I'm Are fine. You okay. Since what about you? <laughs> I actually see your assembly ask. No, I okay, so for me I have main my taste bud is really and I and I hear you can cook a lot. Oh my god. Wow. Melody. Wow. I you Melody Wait, takes her time. No okay, I know where this guy did tell me. Melody believe, takes believe, her believe, time. Believe. Nah, I don't know where you heard that from. Upset, I don't upset. I don't say that. I don't, but let's not do this. Melody, you take your no, time. No, wait, guys. You go to the market. Then we go come get you know some Sprung, go come outside. Some, I you know. Oh my god. Let me go come side now. Wait, 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 can, wait, you, can you can you do like a can we come back to the conversation? Can you do like a games away? night or something? Just I don't us, even know what you're talking about. I don't know. Nah, nah, but no, it's nice. I heard that even your down oh, to your noodles. Oh my god. <laughs> down <laughs> to your noodles. Bro, I don't know what but I will come. I don't know. Wow, Melody. I don't even know. So first time, first time, first time. I don't even know where you heard that information. I know where you heard that information from. Do you or do you not know how to cook? So so give I up. think I try. You think you try? No problem. No. Let me tell you. I, I, I think, think I try. I don't know. I think I don't know when I met <laughs> no, I when I met okay. Melody. I think I met Melody like ah. I don't know. It's been so long, but like we don't talk. But yes, she from Papa so Like on meeting now, every event I see Melody, and you know Melody is the kind of person that when she comes, she doesn't want to like really like talk to people. Yes, it's very, it's very and all of that at the bridge. But, it's very antisocial. Hey, and me. I'm calculating. Anytime I see that, maybe she, she came late, she's not, and she's supposed to be like in the VIP section of something, mm. and she's not trying, you know, she's very, very humble. Uh, I'll go there, I'll 
Or tell them that hey, hey, as this melody, person, I can't even lie. Like allow. I can't even lie. Allow. Every time that Uche has seen me, he does. And I'm like, I'm like, why is this guy doing this? Anywhere, I jam out. Like, I'm like, can you please just let that's me? That's a give. Please, please, please. Yeah, she, she, she. And he does it every time. Bring, actually. bring her yeah. like this. He does it every time. Because I know her. She would never demand that. Actually. So without even what knowing her, like. Me now? <laughs> like, wait. Let's continue. So, what your... where, where I was going was yeah. same way oh with god, cooking. I, I can still tell you. That's... Melody is not is the type that. Oh god, I beg. She doesn't okay, want actually, you to say to go and cook. I actually, know how to. Cook. That will annoy her. But let Melody say, I want to what prepare this. This boom. She's going Where to give you variety. <laughs> She's going to tell you. What do you want? Like, don't do all those things. Uh, come ah, and cook. No. This reminds me of... Let us just say, Chai. I'm in the mood to cook. Man, you're Chai. going to be in heaven. Chai. Chai. What is this about? Remind me of someone very special to me. Yeah. <laughs> I swear down. <laughs> Smith is always going. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> okay, so this is it. Like, anybody Fire out... Godmother. No, God I, I need to say this. If you're out there and you broke Smith's heart, you need to quickly... Real? You need to quickly mend it back. <laughs> Real. You need, to, you need to mend it back because oh I can't. I'm going through a lot, my bro. I'm. Oh my God! I can't okay. count how many times Peter said today. I remember. I remember. I remember. Is it that Shashake Stang remember? Wow, Melody. <laughs> that was a good. Oh, look at. I'm not doing that. That was a good one. How many times Mister? Like, oh God, I remember. Oh my God. I don't. Oh. And the funny part is, I don't know the context, but. <laughs> Every time he says it with so much passion that I'm like, no. Oh, can you please? I'm please. Oh my god. And f- fairy godmother. Fairy godmother. Fairy godmother. <laughs> okay. Wow, fairy godmother. this thing is out in the open. <laughs> fairy godmother. Wow. I don't know what that means, but please, fairy godmother. Help, help him. Smith to help. Wow, Smith. this this is going to be yeah. very useful for this pod. It helps. So everybody. Smith, can you make an apology to fairy godmother? Face one of the cameras. Okay, yes, Smith. You have the altar. You, you have, have the we, This is one thing we will do for you. Easily, Smith, oh don't pay. Yes. Don't pay. Smith, this is your camera. No, no, look in the camera. Smith, this is your camera. Look in the camera. Tell your fairy godmother what you want okay, to tell. Okay, fairy godmother is the person. I mean, it depends. If you oh, want to. I thought it was like. Please. A, okay, cool. Oh, yeah, please, fairy go ahead, godmother. Smith. You have the floor. Smith, you have the floor. It is well. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It is really but, well. But I, the funny thing is that I actually do like the conversation of like Smith saying that. Um, I remember this, I remember that. Because there's also a conversation on social media where, um, so there's this guy, he made this really cool gift for his girlfriend. Mm-hmm. I think he made like a um, like a book or something. I think mm-hmm. on her birthday, put pictures, made, got someone to make her a book, we did like QR code, the book. I don't, wow. I don't really know what it's about. Wow. An album. An album, yeah? Wow. I, oh, well, That's I, so I, romantic. Yeah, so I saw people talking about it and all of that. And, Melody, please. Production. Like, having... Sorry, sorry to cut you short. Have you had that kind of experience? Oh God, no, from guy. The, from the can we, can life. we please? You did sweat. No, no, I did sweat. I sweat. Actually, did sweat because just a I little, don't really but understand. Melody, okay, let me please. My... Don't, don't do it. I mean, have you had these gestures from, from so, men so... in your life? <laughs> no friends. No, we'll go, we'll go ahead, but just, you know? just a little. Okay, have I had what like this sort of have... like grand? Get, I mean, somebody. Well, so. <laughs> Taking out time, I time. Like I actually effort, being thoughtful, I really being, thoughtful like <laughs> being creative, <laughs> act of service. I don't like this. I, okay, so, ah, Jesus Christ. But you can go ahead. I don't like this conversation. But you, but you can go ahead with... with, with <laughs> so, based, um, I have to answer because now I'm like, it's not like I don't say something. <laughs> why, why this? Like, One why person got to answer that. But yeah, so, yeah, um, on that, Yes. have I had like grand gestures? Yeah. Well, yeah. Okay, every, that's, every nice, that's nice, nice to know. That's nice. Yeah, there, 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 there are a lot of women on on the in, internet <laughs> everywhere, like everywhere yearning for something like that. Can we go, please? No, but, but let's let's go ahead. <clears throat> the answer to your question, yes, I have actually. I I think that I as a person, I think that the concept of gifts should be very very thoughtful, intentional. I don't think it's about what you buy. What? Yeah, I think it's about. How you do what you yeah. do and why you do what you do. That is that. that That's makes, so. Yes. I do not necessarily think that you should buy somebody something based on how you feel. Like yes. if you were to, is the person going on? Do you understand yeah. about what the person like? People are bought me shoes that I, I can see now. This is your platform that I would never shoes. wear because it's just not my fashion. Yeah. So I feel like if you want to buy something for somebody, you have to go the extra mile to know why you're buying. Their, Except their, it's the gratification for yourself. Mad. 
you know, it's not for you. Because I feel like giving is service. It should be about what the person. It is actually so, service. It's to do the work of knowing. So basically, before you guys sidelined me to this conversation, the way I was going is that people were now saying that oh, this and da da da. You know, when we see those kind of things on social media, people were like, oh my god, you know, in, in, um, a man did this for his babe and da 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 da, and um, women be doing not not be putting intentionality behind like g- gifting Gift, men. Yeah. I don't generalize though. But do you, as a person, as a man, do you, in your interaction with women, have you been on the receiving end of gifts? Have you been in with people that are very open to gifting you? And what's the most thoughtful gift anybody has ever given you as a nigger? Okay. No, no, no. I'm starting no, with you, Smith. Yes. I no, I'm starting with you, Smith. It's just, my just show. Go. Like, I'll go. I'll go. It's my show. I invited you. <laughs> Melody territory. Production, I swear to. Production. So, it's but like, to be honest, I think you should, I'm, it's not, I'm just, I'm just trying to gauge you because yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I, 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 have, I have, I have had, to be honest, I've had argument on Twitter, the days when mm-hmm. I, back in the days when I had the time for that. Yeah. And, I've, and I've said that it's projection because there's always a nigga on Twitter crying every day about how women don't give them gifts. And yeah. I'm like, that's not true. Because right. I genuinely think that that's women give gifts. And every time I say that, there are always niggas attacking me like, oh, there's not, that's your, you don't know what's going on out here. There's mm. not your reality. Yeah. Men don't get gifts. Men don't get nobody doing nothing for them. Mm. And I think that that's just something that men like to say a lot. Who have yeah. you guys been dating? Yeah. That's my question for them, Sha. Don't you get gifts as a man? Be honest. Yes. Wow. It just had to happen. Smith, no, 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 I don't I, know if you are going to <laughs> win here. Yeah. You said he used to. Or he used to. Like, okay. he literally okay. said he used to. But, but How does but, Smith come, come, but come back? But from your from years of experience of when you were still <clears throat> in that space, but do you, have you been people that used to really gift you? Like, you yeah. know that, you are, you are very sure that at all, at all, in bad. Yeah. I know that, oh, maybe I, Christmas, I mean, maybe my birthday, maybe mm-hmm. Valentine, maybe International Day. So yes, no. it Let's start with an intentionality behind the gift. Yes, I. A lot of people I've been with have actually thoughts about like they give, and it's, it's like because me I'm, I'm very hard to please. Like, understand wow. that. Like do you wow. get? That's new. Like, like if you're giving me something, I I understand that. I don't like it. I'm not going to use it. I'll just be looking at you like thank you very much. Yeah, actually. Like, but you know, go ever see me, they use that. I thing. agree. And I go, I feel gift and back to you on your own birthday plus my wife. <laughs> But yes, um, even like, and I'm not very verbal, like the things I want. Yeah, 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 like, yeah, yeah. So with the people I've been with, there's a lot of thoughtfulness like, in like, me. I'm like, how did this person spot no, that? I, I want that there. And it, it's like it's, it's a nice feeling. It is like I agree. because generally men don't really are not on the receiving end of things in life. And men not really on the receiving end of things. People just They're like not. to say this. So let me. I don't think they are. Let me let me break down my own experience. Our producer thoughts. is blinking his eye. Is there another break? Let's. I mean, we have. Yeah. yeah. But Let me break down my own thoughts. No, I'm not talking to you. In two phases. First of all, I think from a social perspective, I okay. think that women and <laughs> Matawali would like this conversation. <laughs> we I can't wait for it. Women. <laughs> so I think that women women are good PR people. Excellent PR people, bro. So hear hear me out. Mm-hmm. Women know how to intentionally put in your face the need for them to be pampered. Oh. They wake up oh. in the morning, they know, they say their need. They're sleeping in the night, they're, they're saying, saying their need. In the midday, they're saying mm. their need. So like, and men are just going about life. their business. So, With not necessarily memory. even speaking enough as to what they want, how they want to be cared for, just... what they need. Half the time, you see tweets like, what do you give a man that already has everything? Same. That's an annoying tweet. Very, no, it's not very, an annoying very tweet. Very Get it. Hear me out. Because first and foremost, you are with... I have accepted that... Is shaking his head. I have accepted yes, that you, men... Don't show, don't show don't, your love has give you gifts. They don't give you gifts. Your character is bad. I, wait, it's your character. Melody, I'm getting somewhere. Wait, Hazan, you... Melody, I'm getting somewhere. If you want to talk to everybody in this studio, I will tell you, you must talk to everybody. <laughs> yes. No, no, let's not talk to everybody, please. Good. Let's so, not give microphone. So, let's not go too far. So, <laughs> where I'm going is this now. I think that you are right. Mm-mm. A lot of men that receive gifts don't say it enough. 
making it look like but that's where yeah, the that's PR fair. comes that's from fair. That's where, a that's lot of fair. men that, that get this gift don't also come out and say yo, yo I got this I want to tell you about my yes. day yes. How many my of, lady I have two of them and this and this women, women are not vocal about saying about women it. don't and be saying that is what but society you know is suffering women don't do anything hear me out so I think that at the end of the day whether or not those men are not saying enough Mm. Still doesn't change the fact that women are not doing enough. The ratio is still very biased. Very bad it ratio. Is a seventy. It is a good seventy thirty. Eighty twenty. Men, eighty. See, people in the city are saying eighty twenty. Eighty. But me now, I'm being even fair and saying it's 80, a good 80, seventy thirty plus, 12. including those mm. men that are not out there. Because guess what? It's a social spectrum. Is is what it is. Yeah. You understand? And I'm not even saying this as to oh, I'm guiding the men. The men brought it on on, on mm. themselves. You want to be an Odogu silencer. You want to this, that, that, that. You don't want to show your feminine side. You don't want to... Oh. All those things are... Mm-hmm. You have to live with it. So now this woman is looking at you. I'm like, okay, you're a gorilla. Oh, you're a robot. Okay. I shouldn't... I don't know what... Because that thing annoys me. What do you mean you don't know what? Do you know how much fuel costs? Like, do you know how much tires... To change tires cost? I, I, do you know my ex What, what do you say that you don't know what to give the man? What's your what? Ex... No. Got your last birthday. You, you, are, you are a you, wicked person. No, but wait, no. Smith, I'm just giving you an example now. No, but if, do you know what somebody Smith, got for me? Smith literally asked me that. Do you know what my ex got for me? Yes, yes me now. Oh, yeah. So Smith, what? Smith, Tell us. Tyra. 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 Four brand new tires. Lovely. Lovely. And that's like almost brand new. That's like almost 500k. Prof. Crazy. As they give me, I was speechless. I feel like they made them open So, what do you mean by like women don't be giving? Girls? No, I feel like women, women, be- women give. Yes, Actually. my brother, one in a thousand. I don't agree. So, my own is seven. You don't even have the moral standards to say that, so chill. Wow. <laughs> that's, is that that's what we're love. doing now? <laughs> that's chill. a lot. We're just taking shots of producers. That's chill, chill. <laughs> that's a lot. So, but just it's chill. cool, right? I, I think, then personally for me, <laughs> oh my God. growing up, Maybe because of my size, you know. Uh, no, he's he's loved. He's loved no, by everybody. Currently, oh. No, after, currently. Okay, currently. Okay, after a long period of After a long period of <laughs> understanding that, man, okay, I need so to make... So this is the first time you're getting... Actually, in a situation actually, where somebody's I have, I have friends that are visual, like Jabbard, you know, shout out to my guys, mm-hmm. that we were kind of in the same space. Mm-hmm. Same where, place. No, the women when you, when you see me, you think that I have everything. Yeah. Uh, if I knock my native and come yeah, outside, you know, it's, 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 it's giving sugar daddy vibes. <laughs> so it's like, Papa sugar daddy. then also, I actually looked at myself and I said, okay, maybe you too, you are making the wrong choices. Maybe your eyes are flashy, you are going for baddies and all of that <sighs> type of thing. Can I just say, can we God, please not make we, it about no, that? No, 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 I'm not, oh, sorry no. to use that word. No, 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 can I, can maybe. I, can I pitch you something? Yeah. I'd like to take credit on reforming one of the people that reformed him. Oh, you changed his life. Also you helped him to well. pick better. He, he became a strong if, if we want to open it okay, up. Okay, so wait. Smith did not help me to be better. Oh. Smith was head. I was heading for doom. With Smith. Yes. With Is Smith. What he gave Smith you? was saying, mm-hmm. go into the world. Go into the world and search. No. Smith, find. Let me tell you wait, something. So Smith was telling like you Let me tell you street. Smith's accuracy for the, for the sake of this pod. Yes, please do. You know, I promise you that things are going to be... Honest. honest. I like you for that. Yes. But before you say this thing, which was I not, you know what? Sorry. Again, the intentions might be good. But that's what he told That's not what Why are you lying? Like, you didn't ask the, him. I let would say, say his allow that to be that. Now, so now, forget your, I, met I they always say like, my intention does oh, not matter. Look at my situation that though. That for some reason, I mean, yeah, I, I know a lot of people, shout out to them and all of that, but they never do shit. I think that, no, it's not, again, I'm not going to relate because I want you to do shit for me. Yeah, of course. You're not I'm not, I'm just saying that I've observed that there's a pattern where the I'm just there and everything, everything is looking like okay, people are just... Then Smith was like, oh, I have, I have medicine to your problem. What's the solution? Do you understand? Yeah. I sat, myself and Smith, we coordinated. It was like, okay, I'm helping you out now. So how, you are my the, guy. What's the solution? You yes, I'm, I'm getting there. I'm helping you out. You are my guy. And mm-hmm. I, would, I don't like how this is going. I will share you a few of my friends to just... Like, maybe if you look, yes, network and speak. Oh, to. so he now gave you like a melody. I've not gotten to the end. Okay. Smith and I, at a point, my DM with Smith, I was, I was literally running away from the DM. Smith was bombing me with like a Yahoo boy. With solutions. In the morning, in the afternoon, in the, in the night, like different accounts, different account. 
I, I have proof. So now, so from, from, the, from, the, you know, from the long list he gave you, did you find anybody mm. there that was good enough? I was, I was swamped. But did you find anyone that was good enough? No. And did, not about finding... And it's not about... It's, Melody, I said I just want to network. He did not and search. This man profile. sent me like over a hundred accounts. So, so I need to ask you. How do I? How? Do, so, Smith. So, since you have that, since you, because what you are doing now is giving your boy every single day. Wait now, Uchi. Um, so since you have, since you know this thing that your your boy is to say call it bombing. Bombing. Since you have all these accounts and everything. I don't have this account, so let's put it out there. No, 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 no. But you <laughs> gave it to him. <laughs> Why don't you have for yourself now? Wow, Melody! Wow, Melody! This this could be the end of this show. Wait, where are you going? <laughs> no, wait, no. Are you sure that? <laughs> well, no. Actually, we are. We I have, actually don't mean that. This, we are actually making this is a, a good way to end this pod. <laughs> no, but sometimes do you know what that. you are insinuating? No, 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 no. God, let me. <laughs> oh my God! This wait, is what I'm trying to say is that let me do something. <laughs> You know how you will break somebody's heart. Like, yes. I'm not. I'm not even like trying to say anything. Like you know how, like you're with somebody like as a babe or as a guy, and you guys like you're not together or something happens. But because you know that your roster is solid, you like oh I don't care and everything. So but you have this roster to give somebody else. Why didn't you use it for yourself? Why you still? I don't need the roster now. You need only fairy. <laughs> fairy godmother. <laughs> Ah, oh my god, Melody, you are fair. Oh <laughs> right, I'm correct. Are you? correct. So, why are you helping somebody to? So, now you almost destroyed no, his and, life and, and he found and, himself and, by and, himself. And guess what? I so appreciate what he found the, now is better than what he was giving you. I mean, by the special grace so of God. God. So, what are you saying? It, and but also, I want to ask you something. Don't, Uche, don't put it on my guy. Don't put it on my guy. Wait, 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 wait I, I want to ask you something. Wait, sorry, no Uche, sorry to you get your, your opportunity. Don't you think it's a you thing? What do you think you did differently that made you able to attract someone that could care enough to give you stuff as compared to you being I mean, in relationships in the past where nobody used to give you anything? So, you I understand. I think that... like it's I said, thing. Yes. Like I said be, be, um, before, I mean, not necessarily You say you moved away from bodies. Um... Now, my baby is a solid... So, so why are you... So, so exactly. Yeah, she's a 10. So, I, I think I just sort of paid more, more attention. attention. You know, again, this which is what our, I was asking to this do. This is our little place. business because I'm not an industry person. Yeah. This is our little business just gets you out there, and one minute you are in love with whatever you know, mm. that you don't even know from you know, anywhere, and mm. all of that stuff. So, I think I just paid attention and, and focus. yeah, and I just intentionally said, okay, let me just digress from a certain type, type or and a certain book. yes, mm. from conversations you can tell. Right? Yeah. So I'm like, oh, let me try. So I tried and I was cool. So, so this person does not work in the space that you work in? At all. The way you said it is so much tenacity. Yes, like straight up at all. And at all is not that. because maybe, I mean, I didn't want to try someone from my space. I, even the ones that disappointed, not necessarily from my space. So it's just like, even if she's not from my space, she's also the kind of person that and I that synergize sounds... with. Yes, okay, exactly. So Smith... As we wrap you have, up, you have the floor. <laughs> Please give us your last. Help us to sign out. Yes. I should help you to sign out. Yes. Yes, Smith, you want to ask a question. I said, okay, let us your question be what is to wrap up. Maybe Smith, you want to ask. She be you want to ask. So tell him. Thank you for trying to help him and you know take the man away from his glory. Are but you he's know, found are himself. You <laughs> I'm bummed. I was. Uh, are you a Yahoo boy? <laughs> I was creating a path. Create it for yourself. I don't need the path. Okay, you have found where you're supposed I to be. I found where I'm supposed to be. So wh why are you not there now? Yes. Why are you not on that lane? Sometimes when you are on a lane, yeah. you know, there can be bumps, Bump. speed bumps. But you know where you're supposed to be. Yes. Okay. And sometimes you forget that you should be going 60. You are doing 120. Okay. Mm, things like that. So, but you know that this is the lane you're supposed to I know to that. Be. I know the lane. I've Shout seen the house. I'm supposed Shout to out to you. Aww, that's so cute. Okay. Yes, yes. Shout out to you and the house that you're supposed to be. I yes. hope you find yourself back there. <laughs> back there. Or you. Amen. And, and I hope Shout the door out is to, open Shout out to Smith. <laughs> please, whoever has the key should open the door for Smith. Our fairy godmother, please. Yes. Fairy godmother, Smith. Open the door for Smith. Is Smith is at the door. asking that. Said he has found the house. You open the door to the house. Open very the door good, mother. And forget all the bumps. And okay. forget all the bumps. Very good. Oh, one, more okay. one more chance. One more chance.
Hello, Dick. And on that note, we are done. Thank you so much, Simita and Uche, for coming through on the podcast. I had an absolute blast with you guys. Yeah. Do not forget to follow Zero Conditions Podcast across all streaming platforms. Subscribe follow, to the YouTube. Like, and subscribe. Follow Uche and Smith Amen. at. Oh, this is part where we give our handles, isn't it? Yeah, it yeah. is. Yeah, I mean, so Uche, yeah. give them your handle. Yeah, the hand, the handle is um, Uche XSL, just like you can see. You know, we're outside. <laughs> Uche XSL on both Twitter, Instagram. I mean, every every platform. Yeah. yeah. I've given up on all all social media platforms, only Instagram. So okay. the Richard Smith is as TH. He's active on Twitter like mad. I de- I de- I have deleted my Twitter. Okay. I don't cool. do that. No I, I I want to do that. So I've deleted my Snapchat. So right now it's just Instagram. Instagram. So Dear Richard Smith with a Smith okay. with a Y, not the I. Okay. Anyways, so you heard. Please follow them across all social media platforms and follow at Depop Central on social media at, on Instagram and follow at Zero Conditions Podcast. And yes, to so all the listeners, I saw all the comments last week where you guys were really mad and saying that um, Quincy was being disrespected on the podcast and that Timmy B was going on uh-huh. at Quincy. <laughs> And I didn't mm-hmm. fight for him. So the truth is, is that Timmy B and Quincy are best friends. Like they are so close. And they're, they're like parties. So I don't really know. It's not it's the way. Life. It's just a normal way that you know mm-hmm. that Everybody they talk to seems. each other. I'm sure you guys don't have that context, but it wasn't a thing that something was going on, and they were just. It's just the way they both talk to each other. So please, easy with my DMs and easy with the melody. You should have fought for Quincy. And I'm like, nah, that's not really how it is. Sometimes this thing just happen on the on the podcast. You see how the guys be trolling me sometimes. It's not really as you see as melody trolling actually. It's not really as deep every time. I had the whole production yeah, so, be against it's just, me. It's just normal. Timmy V is a cool person and she's friends with Quincy and that's that's his guy. They're really really guys, so it's okay. And on that note, we out. Please keep sending the messages. And yes, I do read every of your messages. Someone was chilling. Melody, I know you will read this thing. Yes, I will read it. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Bye.